Hello. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Hello, hello, hello. Sorry I'm late. I had to go drop off a little package. How's everybody doing? So I already took my nails off. Now I just have to do everything else. So according to my poll and all of y'all, whoever voted, thank you for voting. If you guys voted earlier on my story, what to do to my nails. To be honest, I had no freaking clue what the fuck to do to my nails. You know, like usual. I'm starting to run out of ideas. Um, but I really needed a new set. I really like. I be. Oop, oop, oop. Oops, oops. My water fell. Come on, hold on. Let me put my iPad over here. Um, sorry, guys. Um, I really needed a new set already. Those were driving me nuts. Like, I'd be getting hella bored with my nails. That's why I change them up often. So, this set already is going on three weeks also. So, it's going to be going bye-bye soon. I ended up cutting this nail off because I bumped it not too long ago. And look at my nail. It's lifted all the way to the top. And I'm like, fuck. So I was like, fuck it. I'm just going to cut it, bitch. Um, can you do a tutorial on a cut out? What? Cut out heart? Um, if it's what I think you, what you mean? Yes, I could, but not today because <laughs> girl, hi, Fabi's nails. Thanks for the badge, girl. Um, I'm going to be doing my left hand, which I'm a lefty, so I can't do nothing too crazy because, you know, I'm doing my opposite. I'm using my opposite hand. So I have a couple ideas going on. Let's see. So I was sketching earlier, but I think I'm going to end up going with this. One, two, three, four, yeah, five fingers. This is what my idea came out to be. Algo así. <laughs> They're out of proportion, but you know, that's, that's the vibe. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. So let's get started. Let me cut this nail off. I'm sorry if I do not get to your, your comments right now. Cause I need to get started. And as I file my nails, I'll look up. I have a little headache. I don't know why, but I'll, my fucking head started hurting not too long ago. Maybe um, I need a little coffee. So I made one right now. Hello, everyone. Welcome. So I'm going to start off. Oh, my Lord. My hand is so wrinkled. Look at that shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Lately, my hand has been looking extra wrinkle like dude i know i just turned 30 but relax buddy like stop showing all my lines do any of us in the um audience know how to read hands so you could read all these lines of mine please no mames drink a coca girl i don't like soda like that all right i'm gonna go ahead and File my nails, I mean, file my little cuticle and the little excess dead cells that I be having up in here. Hey, abuelita. Hey, girl. Low key be looking like a fucking abuelita. Drink water, honey. That's why I'm lacking water. That's why my hands are drier because, um, 
or because I'm thirsty. Look at one hand is drier than like more wrinkled than the other. What the fuck? Like not wrinkled, but like the lines are deeper. Weird. I'm like so shook over here. <sighs> no, you look like a señora. <laughs> No, you look like, I am a senora, man. Dehydration. Okay, that's why I'm de Okay, I'm dehydrated. My headache. I've been drinking water, but maybe I need more. You're left-handed, so your left hand will look more used. Damn, I need to stop working, yo. Headache will be dehydration, need water or caffeine. Okay. Okay, doctors. You you is one hand more than the other. Mm-hmm. I sure do. I use my left hand left hand for everything. That's why that one be getting hella abused. Alright, let's get to work now. How's my lighting? Do you guys like it? I didn't turn on all my ceiling lights because I noticed. I mean, I already knew, but I como que I didn't remember. Hold on. Um, I didn't notice that my lights were more on the yellow side. So I feel like that's why my lighting be sucky up in here. All right, hold on. What they say? You know if you're hydrated, if you can pinch your skin and it stays up for a little compared to going back to normal. Pinch it. Like, like this? Am I dehydrated, girl? <laughs> What's wrong with me? <laughs> How do you take your set off? Um, Yeah, I soak my nails all the time. Actually, maybe that's what it was, huh? I soaked it. Pinch the back of your hand. Yeah, I always soak my nails. Yes, you're definitely a little old man. Don't tell my husband. I was actually supposed to go to the gym right now because I didn't go this morning. That's exactly what I was saying. Um, yeah, I was, a, I was on my way to the gym this morning when Patrick's teacher called me. I'm like, Ooh, I forgot, girl. I forgot we had a virtual meeting, honey. Um, this is not on my website. You can get this on Swaggy Tags Official. They customize it for you. And girl, let me tell you, I've been testing this fucking mat already. Like, Sin querer queriendo. The other day that I was live, I spilled shit. Where are your crystals from? These are Swarovski crystals. Not in a creepy way, though, girl. I missed it. I'm dehydrated for sure. Fuck, I don't know what you said, girl. Comment it again. Um, so this mat, they can customize it for you. It's It's a little pricey, but definitely worth it. Because it is going to save your table from all these chemicals. I wish I would have had this long ago. Because I always be dropping dropping shit on my table at work. And it always eats it up. It was going to order, but unos pobre y se asustó el precio. No, dude. You guys should not be afraid of investing. Trust me. i rather pay for the mat ones. That will protect my fucking table and your um your pictures and videos, you know, because people sometimes they repost your work and they don't tag you or sometimes they do or whatever. But no matter what, if your work goes all over social media, they're always going to see your logo in the back. You know, they did give me a little discount code if you guys want to check. I mean, if you want to get one. Um, I'm not sure if anybody else has a code or not, but I was pretty lucky to get one. If you want to buy one, just type in Zule and you get a discount, girl. Um, let me, let me type it in right here. 
swaggy tags tags oh official how do we pin this Um, my code is Zule. Just, I mean, the code is just Zule, not Zule's nails. Just Zule. They made it easy because people misspell stuff. Hold the comment. Oh, I have to hold it over here, huh? Hold on. Hold on, guys. Let me um, pin comment. All right. All right. So there it is. And that's for what? Um, that's for the mat that I'm using back here. This one. I'm going to take it to work on Friday because girlfriend, all my table be fucking getting fucked up. I just got a new table a few months ago and girl, that shit looks beat up already. But anyway, how's you guys' day going? I can't believe today's Wednesday already. I was all up on your website looking for that shit. <laughs> nah, girl, it ain't from my store. I wish I was able to do things like this, but I don't got time. It's handmade also, so just in case you guys are wondering, it's handmade here in the U.S. Estoy en quarantine. Estoy bien, bien harta. ¿O qué dices? Ah, oh, girl. I hope you're you're feeling better. I'm good. Just eating McDonald's. Okay, girlfriend. Get that McDonald's. Great minds think alike. Currently doing my nails. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of nervous because I'm not a big fan of purple. But a ver, ¿qué tal? All right, let me get my nails ready. I'm going to do square since that was the winning, the winning shape. I didn't want to do coffin because I've been doing coffin so many fucking times already. So I was like, all right, let me see. Let me see if I should do square or if I should do, um, what is it called? Stiletto. I haven't done stiletto in a while, but um, majority of you guys chose square. So I was like, okay, girls, I'll do square. I don't know if I'm going to be able to function with a square on my left hand, but. Um, Zule, do you do a layer of clear top coat before you put the gem glue on? Um, You can. I personally prefer to do them directly on acrylic if possible. But if you work with gel polish, I would recommend for you to buff the area um, before you you put the glue. That way the the bling stays on really good and it could dry faster. Personally, I prefer my shit to dry fast. I do not have no patience for it to be taking a sweet time to decide to dry like no girl that shit needs to be fast if not i don't be fucking flipping out i pick stiletto <laughs> i know next time i think i'm gonna do stiletto maybe this design does look better in square only because it'll give me more space to do my stupid hearts you know All right, let's see. Ooh, this one's a little chubby. Let me do another one. When you use stickers, how do you avoid seeing the outline? Um, What do you mean the outline, girlfriend? 
You have to press them real good. Um, oh, I think I understand you. Hold on, let me get a glue. If you're using it over a dark color, the glue, I mean the stickers, how to call it, it'll be more noticeable. It'll be more noticeable when you put on a sticker. I do have this one, but it looks like it's dried up. It's dried the fuck up. Why? Yes, over dark color. Um, I recommend to put it on top of a. Fuck this bitch. All right, let me use this one. Sorry, guys. I'm over here trying to look for some stupid tube glue, but I forgot to grab some before I came. Whenever you're doing decals on dark colors, try doing it um directly on the acrylic on top so that the little... the little outline won't be, like, noticeable, but... If it's still like noticeable, then there's not really much you can do. That's the bad thing about dark colors. Like, you can see everything. Everything on a dark color. Even scratches. You know, like matte top coat. Oh, no. All right. So this finger is crooked. I always say I'm going to straighten it out. And at the end, I still put it crooked like the way it goes. So this finger goes in. I always try to put it going to the right so that it could look straighter to me. Like when I look at it through the mirror, I don't want it to turn like my finger. I hate it. It bothers me so much. But sometimes when I'm looking at my nails like this, um, when I'm looking at them like that, it looks straight. <laughs> like, oh, okay, I did a good job. But then once I go in the mirror and I flip myself off or whatever... Um, I noticed them and I'm like, what the fuck, man? I thought I put it fucking straight, but I fucking did it. So if you ever bought the squeeze glue, this one. And you'll be like struggling with it. It takes a little practice to get the hang of it. But I always, <laughs> now that I'm using it, I wanted to um, point it out because I got like a, a text once when they're like, oh, I can't, like, I don't know how to use it. It gets out of control. Do not try to press it, put it on the nail like this until you get the hang of how much to squeeze or whatever. Um, because it it's so liquidy that it will flood your nail. So what I like to do is just literally barely touch here and get a little bit of glue. And if I get too much, I just kind of dry it off on a napkin and then I put it on I put on the nail later on your bottle will create a little buildup in the rim like just a little bit and it's gonna make the little hole smaller and tighter so then you can like use it like that just a little FYI you know but less glue is better okay do not put too much glue on nothing ever Ooh. Because, oh, fuck. Hold on, guys. My nail fell. If you put too much glue, it will not dry. Fuck. Stupid nail. Get over here. Oh, my God. I cannot function with these squares. Oh, I couldn't pick it up. <laughs> I couldn't function with my square nails. Yeah, if you put too much glue, it will... It'll take too long to dry. So if you ever struggle gluing on nail tips, that's why. Because you put too much glue. And you want to put it at the very tip of the nail. The less nail you glue on, the better. Less glue is better. Is that glue okay to use for press-ons? Um, Yeah, you 
can. Um, if you're going to do them yourself, like glue them yourself, I recommend the tube glue because this one could get out of control fast if you are not used to handling glue, you know? All right, let me wait for that to dry. Sip some coffee. Um, these are the two XL squares. They don't have a C curve. They have a natural curve, you know, for the nail, but they're not C curved. I had a young lady the other day email me thinking she got C curved nails. And I'm like, no, girl, that ain't no C curve. That's a natural curve. You want to see C curve? And I showed her the difference so she can compare. And I'm like, um, that's a C curve. And she didn't respond to me, so she was probably like, okay, girlfriend. All right, so I'm just going to lightly file the tip right here. Mostly in the corner. So later on when I file, my nail tip does not pop out on the side. These are the 2X square, no C curve. Um, We actually restocked the 3X ones today. They were sold out for a little bit, but they back. They back in action and the coffin ones too i was gonna do the 3x ones but to be honest these that i have on this hand are the same length so i was like fuck it i could barely function with squares i don't know if i want to do them extra big and then beat myself off beat myself up you know so i was like no 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 i i need to let this pinky nail grow out all right so when are you going to do the other hand? Um, I don't have a date exactly. I was hoping to leave these on for at least another week. You know, just for demo purposes. Like, um, so you guys could see that the bling does last. Right now, I am applying the nail dehydrator, which is called the Bondade from my ultimate prep trio i'm just applying that to other little nails please guest camera what hi baby hi saludos desde veracruz hola 2xl no see curve yes ideas of your class cost um heather i don't have uh a price yet because they haven't gave me um a price how much it's gonna cost for me to rent the space and if they don't allow me to offer my class where i want it then i have to look for another place so it all depends how much my rent and all of that costs that i have to price the class accordingly Would you ever sell the metal file with replaceable files? I forgot what it's called. Um, I don't think I would. I um, I like the files that I have already because they're supposed to be a one client, um, a one client file, which I like to give them to my clients. You know, and I don't know. I just I just like these files. I don't know how I'd feel about the metal one. I struggle to peel off the little stickies with nails on. So I'm like, mm, do I really want to hate my life? Hi, Donna. Thanks for the badge, girl. I'm going to be offering a class hopefully in March. That's the, that's the goal. But they haven't... Uh, I don't, I'm not sure if where I work at, they're going to allow me to offer the class. I haven't had a response. Thank you, girl, for the other for the other badge. I already asked for permission. I'm waiting for a response. But um, if everything goes good, then I will put out the information. I made a, um, a post the other day announcing it like, nail class coming soon. But um, they haven't given me a response yet. Also, the Lotus, I mean, the Lotus dish, yeah, the Lotus Dampen Dish. This one is back in stock as well. 
So if you had been waiting for it, I know somebody in here. Um, how to call it? I know someone in here was interested. So I don't know if you hear. Would you ever have a class in Costa Mesa if the space was a deal? Um, I don't know how far that is from me. But do you know anybody there, girl? Send me a message. Give me the details. I'm looking for a space to rent for a day or two. How do you use the nail gel resin activator? So the activator, you spray it to, oh, fuck. I think I got it too wet. The glue activator, you use it after you're done applying your nail decor. So that helps your glue dry faster. I'm just gonna apply a layer of clear. I love your brush. Do you sell them? Yes, we do. Actually, check out our brush category. Hobby Lobby has nail stuff for real. I never really look. I only go to their um. I used to go to their flower section. Well, I still do when I go. I go to the flower section or the glitter or the little jewels just to look at them. Patrick likes to go there to buy pipe cleaners. Este pincel es número 12, pero corre chiquito. So te lo, com te lo compararía a un 8 o un, un 10 de otra marca. Hold on. I see some nail tech use acetone to blend the tip with natural nail. Would you recommend doing that? Um, I don't know. I wouldn't recommend that. You can just blend it with the file. No, you do not need no acetone to do that because if you are not, um, what is it called? You can melt your whole tip, you know, if you're not experienced. Patrick! Patrick, can you bring me a, a roll of the blue napkins, por favor? I think they're still in my car. Please. Do both styles run smaller? I have the pink handle and the 12 was kind of small. Um, Yes, the pink ones and this one, they are smaller. So let me show you really quick since we're here. Um, Where is the other one? Look at this is they run smaller than the unicorn ones. So this one, the unicorn one, this is a number 12. Look at the it's a big comparison. But it's just the style of the brush that came like that. And then we also have a number eight in this one, which is still a little bit bigger than this. I don't know, it's confusing, but that's how the manufacturers size them we do have um different different brushes on the website so that you can grab whatever is your favorite let's see um where's my pink one look and then this one is a size 16 which is a pink handle and it's slightly smaller than this one still so it depends on every brush. You need afterpay, girl. I wish the store that I use, the domain or whatever, it does not allow me to use that. But I heard that through PayPal, you can, they have the same thing as like afterpay or whatever. Through PayPal. Let me stir this color. Do you have a size 20? Um, no, we do not have. We have a size 24, actually. Look, let me show it to you. It's right here. Wait. Which one is it? Oh, here it is. It's pretty big. Look at it. I have it here for Mimi. This one is pretty big, honey. Look at it. This is a size 24 and this is a size 16. 
I don't know if I'll be done with that one. So if you have a class, will it be only for locals? I'm from Florida and I would love to take your class. Now, girl, if you down to come over here, you you are more than welcome to attend. All right, let's see. Will your class have after pay? <laughs> no. Well, kind of. Yes and no. So you can pay the deposit now and then play, pay the rest of the class later. That's how it works. All right, let me get my... I'm going to start off with my pinky. That one, according to my chart, is nude. But I want a nude that's a little bit more transparent. So... No, you know what? No, this nude is fine. All right. This is a cover pink nude. The one that I'm going to be using for my... Oh, fuck. Why does that keep happening? Well, I kind of know. Habla español, no entiendo. Oh, perdón, amiga. Es que me están preguntando en inglés. So, si me hacen preguntas en inglés, yo les voy a contestar en inglés. Alright, let me... No entender. Sorry. Qué bit. Puedo utilizar para remover mis materiales en uñas 2X. Um, yo te recomiendo este, mira. Es, uy. Este es el 3X Course. Um, a mí me gusta para remover los cristales y el acrílico de mis uñas cuando me las voy a quitar. Es de mi, de mi tiendita. Esa mi gordita. ¿Quién? ¿Quién es tu gordita? Tu contenido es genial. Quisiera que vinieras a Colombia. Oh, me gustaría, pero no puedo. Qué bonitas las uñas. Gracias. ¿Qué número de pincel recomiendas? Um, a mí me gusta mucho el size 12. Pero dependiendo las uñas que estoy haciendo, es el pincel que uso. Ahorita estoy usando un, el 16. Porque tengo las uñas grandes. I got glue on the bling and he said bottle cannot open it. Girl, run it under hot water, the cap. And it mm, can help to loosen up the glue. But just don't seal it tightly. Or it will continue to happen. If there's glue on the rim. Your website has a dip ombre monomer. Is that the only monomer you carry? No, we have another one. It's called a smooth set monomer. Look, like this one. We have that one too. Right now I'm using the dip ombre monomer. Because that one is empty. I'm running very low of the smooth set monomer. So I gotta use what I got. Let me be an ambassador. Siempre te recomiendo en mis lives en el TikTok. Girl, Melissa, muy pronto voy a tener ambassadors. Ojalá que en los próximos um, meses I, I've come up with a, a, a program or something, you know? Pero tú sigue posteando, okay? I'm gonna see you, girl. Those of you guys who be posting my stuff and supporting me, tagging me on your stuff are the ones who I'm going to be looking looking for, you know? Porque si de ahorita ya you guys support me, how to call it, I could only imagine what you're going to be like as a team, a team member, girl. 
What kind of tips are those? Um, these are the 2x square no C curve. Hola. Senia's nail lunch. Okay, girlfriends. I'm gonna let you guys know in advance. Um, like a month or two when I start to look for them. Zule, I'm trying to find your sugar glitter, the set of seven, and I can't find it. Oh, it's because we just took it off the site. I literally just took it off earlier because we took out the the glitters um, and un set the, I mean, in one ounce. Pero I'll still sell it to you at the same price. Just buy something that lost fifty dollars. And um, leave me a note and I'll give you the set at the same price. Zule is a bad mama jama. She dope. Thanks, girl. Fuck, I can't. Finger, can you relax? I be stiff. Dude, why the fuck am I being stiff as fuck right now? I can't wait to use my Zule goodies that I ordered again. Yes, honeys. I love nail stuff. I love to support you with or without a title because you truly are an inspiration. Aw, thanks, girl. I appreciate all of you guys who tag me um, and like all my stuff. Y'all don't know how much that means to me, you know? You guys make me feel special, I swear. I'll be like, dear, my hose. So this right here is a restock color. I have not added it to the website yet. Uh, What finger is this? Oh, this one. I was going to do it before I came live, but I was already running late. So y'all going to have to wait for this color if y'all like it because it's not on there yet. We had it already before. It's number 48. If you a true Zule collector over here, you bought this color last year when it came out. Your products are the best. Oh, thanks, girl. Gorgeous. I love you. Oh, thank you, Pookie. I'm not a really big fan of purple. I know I say this all the time, but I don't know. It's starting to grow on to me. Where the hell does glitter come from? Like colors that I didn't wear before or did not like. They're just being my best friends in 2022. Like what the fuck? Like I like black now before I did not like that color because it would make me sad. It's just... I'm more bright and colorful, you know? Um, but now it's like, girl, I don't I don't mind black nails. How do I keep my nails healthy? I soak my nails each and every time that I remove them. So if you ever get your nails done and how to call it, you rip them off, peel them off, or whatever off. Instead of soaking them, you are damaging your nails. Um, the best way to take care of your nails is by removing your enhancements properly, which is with acetone, okay? I don't care if you soak off your nails halfway and you leave a little fucking layer, and then that little layer, you rip it off. Like, there's... Why? Why'd you do that for? Because I know some people doing that shit. And then they wonder why their nails are fucked up. Like, girl, no. What the fuck was the point of soaking the uh, rest of the fucking nail? No, you gotta soak the whole thing. The whole baby. So... Each and every time that you remove your nails like that, you're ripping off a layer of your nail plate. So if your nails don't grow very often, like they don't grow fast, imagine you do that twice or three times a month. 
and your nail, your full nail doesn't take, it takes about half a year to fully grow back out, your shit is going to be thin as a motherfucker. So don't do it. Trust me. Like I have clients who say they soak their nails, but I could tell they don't do it properly because of their natural nail. It's hella thin and red. And I'm like, girl, you did not, you were not patient, were you? And then they'll be like, yes, I didn't rip them off. I'm like, girl, your lie, your nail is saying you are lying. You soak them. Um, then your nail lady is damaging your nails. She don't know how to use her file then. They should not be damaged if you are removing them properly. Unless... Unless your nail lady is doing the damage. Because if they're not properly trained with an electric file, you can still damage the nail. Mm-hmm. They be lying. Mm-hmm. To me, primer damages your nails more. No, girl. Primer does not damage your nails. Who told you that? The primer is used to adhere the nail better. Oh my God, you're on. Yay, yes, honey. Hola, amiguita. Voy llegando. Hola, I'm not here and I'm going to have to get me some Zule products now. Ooh, yes, girl. Welcome. I do my own Zule, but when I do other people's nails, they aren't thin. Okay, girl. Maybe you just have natural, I mean, thin nails. I'm not sure. Based on my experience, it could probably be the way you are applying your nails then. You know, like maybe you overfile your natural nail. Because if you remove them properly, they should not be damaged. Fuck no, my ombre is not looking cute, guys. What the hell? I think we're getting spammed in the chat again. Maybe. And it's early, actually. All right, let me try to even up this this ombre over here. My nails actually are not, they're naturally pretty thin. That's why I do not rip my nails off. But they're pretty healthy compared to other other people. But I do have to sit my ass for a while and how to call it soak those little bitches off it's nearly 10 here 10 it's barely gonna be seven here in two minutes my not thin and i prep and i prep and then damage them in the beginning me gustó tu video en español gracias beatriz Me tardé un poquito para hacer el video, pero pues ahí está. I cannot get this ombre to look bomb. What the hell? My pastel, sugar, sparkly matte, everything, honey. Um, I'm going to be using one of my sugar colors today so you guys can see them. You can always add glitter, cover the flaw. I know I was thinking about that. I could add glitter since I didn't have glitter in mine. My right hand is not that good at like blending. I can't do that little stroke with my right hand. It's like useless over here. Just kidding. Just kidding right hand. Come on practice girl. I'm too rough with it. 
so with ombre the key is to use like the tip of your bristles and lightly blend it but my right hand is so stupid it doesn't know how to do that like lightly i mean it's looking okay i guess not the best ombre but it will do maybe i'll put glitter i don't know mm, let's see um purple are you lefty yes i am that's why i'm struggling a little bit right now because i am working with my opposite hand se va a tapar con el bling no pues es que ese dedo todavía no tiene um no tiene bling bling en mi diseño no le puse bling bling pero pues tal vez le vamos a tener que poner bling bling Gentle, yes. I'm so nervous to be doing all this purple. I originally only had like one nail purple. <laughs> and then I was like, girl, you need more purple in your life. You need more. I know the struggle. I'm a lefty too. Oh, yes. Lefty squad. All right. So I'm just giving this acrylic a little time to dry because... It dries a little slower. And I'm going to do the whole nail in this color. So I need to. I need to be a little patient. Why don't Mimi do my nails? I haven't asked her to do my nails. If I ask her. She would do my nails. But. I have to let her know in advance. So that she could plan her day accordingly. When you do clients nails, do you put a clear layer first? Yes, I do. I always put a clear layer. Especially on my clients. Because they fucking move so much. Some of them, while I'm like looking for a damn color... Or I go up to pee or something. Like they forget they're not supposed to move. So if they touch it, I don't want their nails to fall off, you know? Hey, I'm a beginner. I'm also lefty, but sometimes I want to fucking quit because I have a hard time laying the acrylics started in December. Girl! Zilly, you are a hella beginner. Do not give up. You are on your way, girl. It takes a lot of practice to lay it especially in the winter okay make sure make sure that your room is a nice temperature at least 72 degrees for your acrylic to dry decently because if it's too cold it will be like water okay so if you apply your acrylic like right now i'm giving it time to start to harden a little bit because it's like 50 degrees here, so it's lagging. If I put it and I start working with it, I drag it and there's going to be nothing on the nail. So that takes time to learn as well. Not all the brands, not all the colors are the same. Different brands work different speeds. So maybe you want to keep practicing. Don't give up. It's too soon to give up. The stroke is real. Don't give up. Mm-hmm. Mama race no quitter. All right, girl. Girlfriend. Just keep at it. Practice, practice, practice. But for sure, the temperature, learning about temperature is key. I wish I would have known that. Let me see if my heater is on, actually, because I'm fucking cold. Um, If I would have known that a long time ago, I feel like I would have got the hang of it sooner. So you're welcome. I'm giving you guys some free game here. Because that it took me a while to kind of learn that shit. I used to be like, man, this fucking product sucks. 
because it will dry too fast or it'll dry too slow or da 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 da, da or whatever. But um it was it was just that I did not know my product. I took your tip with adding acetone to your monomer for the flowers, the best tip. Mm-hmm. You welcome, honey. I try my best to give you guys the advice I wish I would have been given when I started. But back then, there was not that many people that did nails. Well, I don't know, actually. I feel like social media was barely a thing. Like, it was barely popping, you know? Now, if you a beginner and you don't take advantage of all your... Social media platforms, girl. I don't know what to say to you. It's so easy for y'all to to get to this. Whatever it took me four years to do, you could do it in a year or two. That's how easy it's got for you guys. Okay? It's okay. You can suppress me. I don't care. We can all win together. Just remember, I'm your... I'm your tia, okay? My struggles filing the sidewalls. Their mom and sis say I'm too rough. What do you recommend I do? Girl, slow your roll. <laughs> Why are you so rough? You angry or what? What size, I mean, what grit um, file do you use? Maybe you should use a softer one. I recommend... If you're still starting to do to try 80 or 150 so that you don't cut nobody or hurt them. I have to go slowly here because no puedo ver con el pinche fondo de mi face. I've been trying to grow my pages so hard, girl. Right now, Instagram is, um, I feel like it's showing new pages to everybody, like exposing them or giving them the advantage of engagement. So just post, girl, post. Because I have a new page that I made months ago. I don't know how long it's been, but I did it like as a backup page because I was going to do a personal thing, but then I didn't. So I just kept it nails, nails related. And I posted there the other day. I posted a few things in the last couple of months, but I noticed that that stupid page got more attention than this page that I have thousands of fucking followers. And it's like, what the fuck? Why? Like, right now, my traffic on my page is ridiculously slow. It's like, I'm about to erase this page and just go to my little 1,000 followers page because it's ridiculous. Like, what's the point of me having all these followers if y'all can't interact with me, you know? So, if you're a beginner, don't lose hope because Instagram is on your side, okay? They're helping you grow your page and all of that. You just have to do your part and you have to post. You have to do your your job. Yep, Instagram be on some bullshit for real. Like, I'm about to like, be like, deuces, I'm leaving to Facebook or some shit. But nah, I kind of, I like Instagram. But not their algorithm and shit. Why are you moving slow? Because my stuff doesn't dry fast and I am slow. I am slow. You're so good at connecting with your audience. I try my best. Girl, I think I I came across your backup page and I thought it was fake. I have actually had a fake well people make fake accounts. But that one is mine. Look, it's so cold in here that I started to get my acrylic is like crystallizing. That normally does not happen unless it's super cold. Can you guys see that? 
I'm definitely going to add glitter now. So if that ever happens, your room is too cold. You need to turn up that heater a little bit. YouTube Live is getting really good. And their shorts. Lots of interactions. Okay, I'm going to have to go into YouTube. I haven't really done many lives on YouTube. Only like four or so. You got the AC on. No, I don't. I have the heater on, but I can't even feel it. Since I started to do my own names, my family and friends don't even like my pics I post. Like, I know I'm not the best at nails, but I think it's because they want free nails. And I said I don't do free. Man, fuck them. Fuck them, CC. What is your room temperature? Um, Right now, I don't know what my room... According to my um thermostat, it's 70 degrees in here. Or upstairs. But outside is pretty cold. Let's see. Alexa, what's the weather like right now? No mames, güey. Con razón tengo frío. It's fucking 36 degrees, bitch. No, I don't want a healthy eating. Nothing. Bye, bitch. Alexa, hang up. No, I want to hang up with you, bitch. Let me crank this heater up. No, hombre. Si está frío, el lugar se tarda. No mames. No mames, güey. Ok, ya 10 años después y todavía en la uña del medio. <ríe> ¿De dónde eres? Soy de California, pero vivo aquí por las montañas y está bien frío. No mames. So this morning, our grass was frozen. Ok. Some people use a cup warmer to place their monomer to keep it warm. En la madrugada vamos a estar a los treintas. Oh, hell no. Honey, I like cold, but bitch, my tits gonna fall off like that. Uh, Let's see, my ring finger. I'm gonna do... I don't know what to do on my ring finger yet. It's still up in the air. Um... What the fuck was I saying? That is fucking cold, I think. That's what we're talking about. Oh, yeah. I be getting lazy to um get the fuck up in the mornings because it's so cold. Damn, bitch. Don't tell me que ya te me secaste. The heater came up that fast? That fast, honey. Kelly's cold at night. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, that I live over here by the mountains, huh? Yep, it'd be cold. So cold. Like, I love the cold, but like, me duele las manos cold. Any advice how to keep it smooth, not bumpy? Um, it takes practice to not get it bumpy because I still get it bumpy too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember what I was reading about the cup warmer. I tried that. It didn't work for me. So I noticed that whenever I have more control on my acrylic, like when it's warmer, not too runny, um, I'm able to lay the acrylic smoother. So maybe try to work like hold your acrylic in your brush for a couple seconds if it dries too fast i mean too slow or if it dries too too fast then you gotta work fast girl and it will be smooth just give it time and then you work give it some time Mood. 
A mí tampoco me sirvió. Mm -mm, no, a mí no me sirvió. Sí calentó la, el monómero, pero todavía se me secaba demasiado rápido. la like, what the fuck? No, día 18. What? What, 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 what? I was part of a lumpy crew for a while. Girl, me too. Trust me, we all been there, honey. We all lumpy nails for a good minute. Why do you think I'm so buff? I had to file for days before. I feel like I still file for days, but because I want to. Like, I love to file now. Nah, just kidding. I hate fucking... Um, I hate fighting. I'm part of the lifting crew right now. <laughs> You're funny. Um, these, yes, these are my website. They are the two, two Excel square. Two Excel square. I think my ring finger, I'm going to end up putting some glitter. I just don't know which one. No chin. I have clients who complain itching after set about what she's probably becoming allergic to your to nails. What kind of monomer do you use, girl? Let's see. I was team lifting till I got to lace trio. Okay, girl, crazy queen. Welcome to the trio game. Trio, trio, trio. If you are a problem lifter or you have problem problem lifting clients, you need the ultimate prep trio, okay? Let me tell you. I have a problem lifting finger. My index finger. This one, oh my God, before, back in the day, or not that back in the day. That bitch, that was the nail that I was always missing because it will never make it to whatever weeks of nails I had. Never. It would always fall off, no matter what I did. And ever since I started using the Ultimate Prep Trio, it's already been like a year or two. Don't have a problem. I always have that nail. How long did it take you to do your own nails? Um, it takes me a long time. I've been here for like three hours just doing one hand. But if you mean like how many years did it take me to learn how to do my nails? I've been doing my nails for like 10 years already. And I still struggle. But in the beginning, oh lord, it was so hard. But I use so much. What? My struggles always having a crooked nail on my non-dominant hand. It never fails. Girl, welcome to my life. I always have crooked nails. Crooked nail for a crooked hand. As a matter of fact, we're talking about it right now. How do you know how much powder you need for each finger? Um, normally I measure how much I need by looking at it sideways, like at my sideway angle like this, like this is definitely too thin. I'm going to add more, but I'm going to put clear on it because that one dries faster than this one. Um, hold on. I'm going to put a little bit of, actually, hold on. Let me get a glitter. Let me get a little glitter, 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 acrylic. Let's see. Do not get loud with me. All right, ma'am. Where are you, Kala? Oh, here you are. 
All right, I'm gonna be using this glitter. It is called Crystal. And it's like a iridescent glitter. Check it out. It's like iridescent chunky mix with a little bit of silver. So beautiful, gorgeous. Let me cover this up just in case. Oh, I should make it an ombre. Ooh, honey. All right, I'm just going to put this in the middle. This was something that I used to do years ago when I didn't do a very nice ombre. I used to put a little bit of glitter in the center and then just like ombre it up and down, you know, to kind of camouflage it. And bam. How would they know? How would they know? It's like you could still see it not that perfect, but the glitter just catches your eye and it's like, what? There's an ombre there? What? It's not perfect? What? 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 You know? And that actually looks so cute. I'm actually going to do an ombre on that one too. Because it is so cute. I'm just going to add a little bit more because you can never have enough glitter. Oh my god, girlfriend, look at that. Yes. Haces envíos a Canadá. Sí, enviamos a Canadá. I'm just going to put some clear acrylic over this really quickly so it does not crystallize just in case it wants to because it's hella cold. Hella. And the clear acrylic, this one dries faster. So. It should not crystallize. <sighs> Zule, how do you fix the dent in the application with clear acrylic? So normally I apply a thin coat of color and the rest I encapsulate. So right here on this one, I didn't apply it like the thickness that I want. I'm going to go back from here to like here and apply clear acrylic. So this is how thin they be looking like. And the rest is... Oh, that one doesn't have shit. And the rest, I put clear. Um, hmm. Should I do my ring finger ombre with purple? Or should I do it nude with this glitter? What do you guys think? What do you think? What do you think? Las clases priva privadas virtuales. Um, por el momento no, pero voy a empezar a, a ofrecer clases de nuevo. Marble. I already did marble last time. No marble for this set. Yeah, last time I did it on this hand, I was looking like a fool. Nude with glitter. Nude with glitter. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Nude with the glitter. Y'all read my mind. Yeah, last time that I did <laughs> marble on my on this hand, I was looking like a fool. I didn't even know how to make that little that little what is it called? The little stroke and shit. I was like, uh uh, honey. I'm um, sorry, ma'am. I can't do French. That's that was not an option. Not today. Oh, I already had French last time, so we gotta change it up a little bit. So I'm just gonna do this. Right? I had a French now. A V French or a normal French. I don't know what kind of French I had, but I had a French. Hi, crazy. Thanks for the badge, homegirl. Oh, girl, somebody is commenting that I missed your comment, ma'am. The one saying something about three years coming to me. Can you repost your thing? My comments are moving a little fast for me today. <clears throat> Can you help me? I want to know how to fix dip. 
um you have to fix it with acrylic clear acrylic what does it mean when your acrylic crystallizes it means it normally happens when there is a fan or ac on or if your room temperature is too cold and your acrylic is drying super slow aka it's cold as fuck so i will show you again but i already covered it it just looks like bubbles bubbles but like crystal at the same time like i see um yeah we do ship to puerto rico this brush is size 16. how did your art advanced class go in vegas it went very good i did really good actually i was super surprised at how well i did i mean i was really expecting for me to be the worst student not gonna lie because i can't draw but um let me show you actually i have my little things here my my little nails that i painted look this was my first the first set that we did girl i was like what i didn't know i could draw a fucking eyelash okay they're a little dusty right now so this flower look at the flower it came out kind of funny like i didn't know how to like move the brush it was all new to me, but I'm super, super proud of myself. Like, bitch, bitch. They came out fire. And then this was the second one. Look at the flower, how bomb is going to look another side. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Wow. Look at that professional stroke. No, I just kidding. The first, the first flower of this style that I made was so fucking ugly and embarrassing. I threw it away. Then, then there was this one. Look at my improvement. This is why you have to save your fucking practicing years. Because you don't know that you've improved or you can't tell the difference until you compare them. So this was my second attempt. Look at the petals. They're like kind of funny looking. And then I did this one. It got better. And then finally that one. It got better. Okay. But look at my manly girlfriend over here. Look at her bushy brows. Yeah, that's what I learned. I was so proud. And I did not pass out, bitch. I did not pass out. I was like, okay, it's late. Okay. Are the square nails with no C-curve good on your website? Is better with the C-curve. These are the no C-curve ones that I'm using. Um, It's more of your preference. Do you like C-curve or do you like them... More no C curve, you know? Some people cannot um, function or they don't know how to work C curve nails, like to apply them. So it's more of a preference. I personally like C curve because it's easier for me to file now that I know how to file them. But a lot of my clients don't like them because they're not used to the curve at the tip. Let me see if I have some here and next to me. So I could show you the difference. Um, look, I think I have these. So these are XL square C curve. So let's see. Can you guys see the curve in there? It's like curved the little c curve and then look let me show you can you guys see the difference like this one has a natural curve to the nail but this one is like extreme c curve i'm not sure if you guys can see it or not but it's like pinched okay so for people who have Fingers that are wider, like nail bits, C curve tips, kind of um, um, what is it called? Make it look a little bit more slim, like if it had a faja on top of vibe. Those are the ones I should be using, but I struggle to do my nails with normal tips, 
So I don't know if I want to do that on my opposite hand. Maybe my next my next set on my right hand, I'll do them C curves so you guys can see. My boyfriend said they look like straws. <laughs> Low key. Mm -hmm. Talking about straws, somebody re requested me to do one of those curly nails. I still haven't done it. I forgot. All right, so that's enough glitter, I think. Um, if you guys ever message me, text me, or whatever, and I don't respond, or I do respond, but you ask me to do something like a specific video or post or whatever the fuck it was, bitch, I forgot. So you gotta tell me again. I have a memory de la pinche Dory. Okay, de la pinche Dory, a la verga. I forget shit so fast. It's like yesterday I went to the fucking store, right? And I purposely told Patrick, oh, I'm not going to get bread. I don't need it yet. And today I decided to make sandwiches, right? And I'm over here taking everything out and no tengo pan. Like, no mames, güey. Como vergas vas a hacer un sandwich sin pan? Like, what the fuck? Like you literally just said yesterday. Ooh, hold on, guys. I'm taking a picture for the Instagram. Before encapsulating. Gotta get the right angles here. The right lighting, too. Porque... Another thing I've noticed that if you guys don't have nice pictures, people ain't gonna hit the like button. Like, let's see how many likes these stupid square nails get. Let's see. I'm gonna go post it right now. Let's see. Let's see. Should I post those? 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 Hmm. I'm just going to post the last ones I took. A ver, ¿qué tal? How many likes I get on my square nails? Let's see if my, el público likes square. Square nails, gay or nay. Two XL, no C carb. Sorry, guys, hold on. You guys feel neglected? Um. Okay, hold on. Hey, girl, I got my package today. Mine is the one that kept going back and forth. I tagged you with a pig, excited to use my stuff. Oh, the one, um... Lil Savage, which one? The one of the hearts and the penis ones? <laughs> Your penises? <clears throat> I'll go like too and get back on the live. Okay, okay. Go like, go like. Look, guys, so I already um, dropped monomer over here. And boom, I saw your TikTok and I just spotted your nails. They are so cute. Thank you. All right, now time to encapsulate these bebes. I had to follow your page. Oh, thanks, girl. Welcome, Danielle. Welcome to the Zule Club. All right, guys. Y'all ready? Ready or not, here we come. I got my package on Monday, but the number seven nail tips weren't in my package. Girl, what do you mean? Um, Send me a text, Sandra, with your full information. Like, what's your order number? What? And then I can see which tips you ordered. Because sometimes the, in the manufacturers or the factories or whatever, these people be playing games and shit. Like, uh-uh. How could they be forgetting your number seven? No, ma'am. We we'll send them to you. Just send me a text. Go to my bio. And my phone number is on there. 
I'm not going to respond until tomorrow, but I will respond. Okay. And for any of you guys who be in my freaking emails demanding an answer while I'm sleeping. Why? Why do y'all do that? That's one thing that oh irks me so bad. Like, <laughs> I had this person... And it's not only happened once, it's happened a few times, but not that many. Where, like, they email me, like, at, I don't know, let's just say 8 p.m. Obviously, I'm not working. And then, again, like, at midnight or, like, four hours later. Like, dude, I'm fucking sleeping. Of course, I'm not going to respond to you yet. Why you getting mad, girlfriend? Like, why do people do that? Why, why, why? Like, I'll get to you when I wake up or when I go to the computer. <laughs> I don't think that's any of us. Use. Um, let's see. Do your sales go up after a live? Not really because you're the best commercial for your products. Um, it depends. Sometimes I do get some sales, but I mean, not always. I guess it depends on the day of the week. If people got paid or not. But everybody should go place an order. So y'all can keep me in business over here. Because businesses are struggling right now. Hi Bianca. Do you ever just turn your phone off like fuck this? Girl that's why I got a work phone. Yes. I just abandon it. Like mm mm. Like, not today, Felicia. I'm not going to answer this. I learned that I have to do that sometimes. Like, I'll be on Instagram, but not... I'll be on my personal phone. So, if you email me or text me, Zuley don't see it. Do you sell your own acrylic powders? Yes, ma'am. I sell my whole brand, the whole shebang. Your order was completed with a star. That was not me. That was my husband. If you get a smiley face, that was me. Hi, Zule. Any additional info on your upcoming class? Girl, I'm still waiting for the approval of the space. I feel like I've been putting so many fucking um, beads on this stupid nail. That's how cold it is still. Even the fast one dries slow. So I brushed the shit out of it. So I haven't gotten a response yet. I messaged them yesterday or the day before. To see if they had an answer for me. Price wise. Like how much my rent's going to be and stuff. So that I could start figuring out my numbers. Like how much the class is going to be. And I could give you guys all the info. But it's already been like a week and nothing. Have you ever used another brush? A bigger brush? Yes, I have, but I cannot control it. I, I'm not sure if I can function. I'm just going to put a little bit more. Where did you get your table? I actually had it custom made. But to be honest, I didn't really like it that much. I want to get a new table again. I feel like I'm too tall for this table. I can't wait for your class. I'm so excited. I can't wait to have another class. I hope that my class, if I do happen to, to have it, um, I have like the best group ever because I've always really had really good groups. Like the young ladies and all of that that attend. They be like with good vibes but there's always that one fucking girlfriend that's just gonna be a little a little bitter all the time never fails so if you one of those don't come please do not come with your little attitude because i will slap you 
um, how fast is the shipping? So normally order processing takes two to four business days, depending on how much work we have. And then the orders, um, they ship, the shipping takes two to five business days, depending on where you're at in the, in the U.S., Yeah. Why are you guys laughing? Because what I said about slapping, slapping you, like if you come with that little attitude, mm -mm, honey, no. Positive vibes only, okay? I'm, I'm going to make sure to bring my Nespresso machine so y'all can be happy. Like, tienes cara de fuchi, tomate un café. <laughs> When will you post information about your class and where can I find it to book a spot? Um, as soon as I am approved for the location, I will post it up. So turn on them notifications. Hold on, guys. I have to move a little fast because it's acrylic be drying fast now and that the heater is kicking in. I don't want my little acrylic to dry because then it becomes lumpy. Um, no, you do not have to be licensed. If this is a hobby or whatever, you are more than welcome to attend still, you know? She's hosting two classes, one in LA and no. So I'm trying to find out where my location is going to be because I work in LA. That's where the salon that I work at is at. But I don't know if they're going to let me do my class there. If they don't. Oh, shit. Am I still on this finger? Oh, yeah, yeah. If for whatever reason I'm not able to because they have to use the salon or whatever. Then my second option is going to be out here where I live. I'm going to have to look for something over here. That's why I put the two locations because it could be either or. But we'll see. Um, No, whenever I have group classes, I always offer a kit. The only thing you'd have to bring is yourself and your electric file if you want one. But um. That's it. Everything else comes included in the kit. What do you do? Online classes? I have done online classes and I personally don't really like them. I feel like they're not the same, but I will try to do like a monthly class maybe in the future online. I don't have a price for the class yet. It still has to be determined. But I need an answer first from my landlord. Because depending on what my rent is like and all of that. Like I can't just throw a number out there. I have to figure out how much is my rent. How much are my tables. How much product I'm going to be putting in the kit. How much is the food? Because obviously I'm going to feed your asses. Because I don't want you to eat me. i just kidding. You know, like all of that comes into place when you are hosting a class. It's kind of like when you're pricing your nails, you know? You can't just somebody show you like, oh, ¿cuánto estas uñas? And you're like, uh, 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 hold on. Let me, let me do the math. Let me add it up, you know? Um, so... Yeah, what was the rice of your last class? Girl, my last class was like three years ago. I do not remember. I haven't had a class in a good minute. But last time they didn't charge me rent. <laughs> they let me do it for free, I think. But nobody does nothing for free anymore. So, you know, we got to pay up. I literally thought you own your own salon. No, girl. I I pay rent. Yeah, I'm going to feed you all dick cake. 
<risa> ¿Quién quiere pito? I'm just kidding. No dick cake. Sorry. No, yeah. I always provide some food. Because my mom always said that if you hungry, you don't learn. So your ass gotta be fed. Um, the princesita brush is runs big. Well, the the ones with the glitter they run bigger than the other ones. So a size eight in princesita, I would compare it to like a size uh twelve fourteen. I'm from my Vinland. Ooh, yes, honey. I've been trying to find a booth rent. How's it going? You have to keep it open. Oh, yes, the glue. Try not to close it all the way because it is so strong that if it gets, if you seal it tight and there's glue on the rim, mm, good luck. It's going to get stuck for life. So, look, let me show you my glue. I normally keep my glue like this. Well, this one is already open, but normally, like, literally just close it and that's it. Host it in your backyard or garage, girl. Mm, I can't do that. I, I'm not trying to get kicked out. <laughs> I'm not allowed to have people in my house like that. My HOA will come fucking running because my neighbor, one of my neighbors I heard is a rat. Who knows? A nosy little rat who's going to rat me out. And then I'm going to get my ass kicked out. I think I found my dream job, but I'm scared. Monique, baby, why? What you scared of? What you scared of, Monique? Mm -hmm. All right, I need... What happened to my nail? Oh, I cut it off. I cut it off because um I got hurt again. And my nail lifted like all the way up. Look it. You could see it up there how lifted it is. So I cut in a couple days ago or maybe a week ago. Will the space be limited? Yes, of course. I cannot. The salon where I work at is not that big. So we could only fit a certain amount of people. Unless y'all want to be like sardines, then go for it. But we in COVID, girls. So, got to keep that in mind. COVID is still around. Not a lot of people are allowed to be in one room. Especially if y'all sneezing and coughing. i just kidding. <sighs> because it is a straight nail shop, you know. And I'm like, I'm still learning. Girl. That's how you're going to learn. Just throw yourself on. Throw yourself on the fucking ocean. Like, fuck it. Can you come to Fresno? No, girl. I'm not traveling. You come over here. The farthest I'm going to travel is to LA. That's how far I'm going. It's easier for you to come to me. Zule don't travel like that. I hate being in a car for longer than two hours. I'd be like hella stressing out. Like, what the fuck? Like, when I was going to Vegas, no mames, ya me andaba muriendo. Like, dude, I almost there yet. Two more hours. Like, what the fuck? Two more hours, bitch. And I was on my phone. You know, I was distracted. But it was still not enough. Where are you? 
located. Right now I am um in my casita. You never followed back. Girl, did you comment on my thing? I swear I follow like I don't know 50 people the other day. You probably commented too late. Who goes with you? To Vegas? Go comment on the post that I just posted of my purple nails. Go like and comment if you want me to follow you. Be like, follow me back, Zulane, and I'll go follow you when I'm done. But only for today because if you go and comment tomorrow or the next day, I don't go back to the picture. Like, it's rare. And I be getting so many notifications that I don't even know who the fuck tagged me in wood or like my shit or commented here. So do not think I'm ignoring your comments if you ever comment or tag or whatever. I just don't get to see it all unless it's like from today or tomorrow or whatever, you know. And if you guys... Um, I have not forgot to choose a, uh, I have not forgotten to choose a name for that one acrylic. I know it's already been like a whole motherfucking week, but I went to work the next day and the following when I posted the video and I haven't looked through all them damn comments. So I still need to pick a name for the color, but you're more likely to get responded to if you comment on somebody's post when it's fresh a couple hours 24 hours fresh after that if it's an old post people will most likely not get to see that unless they on their phone 24 7 just saying look let me see Okay, guys. How the fuck did I have 51 comments? Are you guys already commenting on it? Like, ma'am. Fire, fire, fire. Hearts, heart, 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 hearts. Okay, guys. I'm definitely not going to be able to follow all of y'all back. Y'all are too many. i just kidding. So, at the end of my nails, I'll go follow you guys. Y'all are Fast, yes, if we're para para todo. <laughs> That's what your moms will be saying. If you Mexican, you know, you know, like how to call it. Um, they'd be like, they would always say shit like that. Si así fueras para la escuela, like mom, relax. Like mother, relax. I can be good at everything. I seen my comment. Oh, yeah, girl. I was like, the fuck? This must be the wrong profile. How, how the fuck do I have 50 comments already? I forgot I told you guys to go comment on that shit. <sighs> all right, ladies. I see all them little purple hearts, little fire hearts, and my iPad right in my face right now. Okay, gosh. Follow me, Zulay's Nails. Okay, I'll follow you guys. I'll follow you guys shortly when I'm done, like three hours later. What school do you recommend we go to so we can get licensed? To be honest, the school does not matter. Um, They all teach the same thing as far as like state board and all of that. So just choose whatever is the most affordable in your area also if you want to look at reviews go ahead but to me i feel like normally i don't go by reviews for nothing because people are most likely to review always when they're mad and happy or whatever than when they're happy so when people have a lot of bad reviews is just because the karens came out to review not the happy people
you know but anyway yeah just choose whatever is the cheapest girl because you're not gonna learn much i mean you're gonna learn but not what you want to learn you know that's why you have to continue your education damn my square nails be looking a little funny I'm doing a pretty good job with my squares. Um, any tips on what else to do before state board? Um, well, what I would recommend, because I don't know if they do practical where you're at, but how to call it, I am not the best at studying. So what I did and worked for me was I made flashcards on like the key terms because I feel like those are the what they trick you in the most I feel they all be sounding the same and looking the same and I'm like the fuck you could get tricked real quick with all these osmosis or whatever the fuck I don't even know how to pronounce them um so I did flashcards and I and I studied those like two days before the test I ain't even going to come here and lie to you and tell you I studied all day and all night because I don't do that. I study the day of the test, okay? And I only did that because I was pretty confident that I knew my shit. And I knew that if I fucking studied the night before, I would forget the next day. So why would I put myself through that? But yeah, that's it. That's all you got to do. Pay attention in class. Pay attention in class. Learn your shit. And in high school where you gonna just pass by flying colors. No, no, ma'am. You need to pay attention and get good grades in the test that you do in class. And for state board, you should be fine. Just study the key terms. And everything else should be fresh in your brain. Like, if you don't pass it, girl, I don't know what else it could be. Like, you are not paying attention. Zule, which nails are we supposed to request you? Um, In the last post that I did of these nails, I posted these nails before I encapsulated, encapsulated them. Hi, Luigi. I want the new bid you just got on your store. Oh, the new bid? I'm going to use it today. It's my best friend. It's going to be my new best friend. Especially for stiletto nails. Oh my God. I should have got that shit long time ago. Because girl. To get these freaking stilettos to be stiletto. Oh my Lord. It takes so much arm work. I've legit been learning lots from your lives. No school self taught loca like me. Got kids and can't afford all the school crap. Okay girl. Well, that's good enough. Shit, we learn more out in school, out in the real world than in school. It's kind of like going to college, you know? They teach you certain things about your field. But then once you go out to the real world, you're like, the fuck, I didn't learn this shit in school. You learn different things in as you go, you know? So school teaches you one thing and then you learn life skills or just whatever i don't even know you know what i'm trying to say you gain experience in the real world what it really like you know both both are good both are important which bit this one oh fuck this one he's talking about this one I'm going to be using it right now when I shape my nails. I'm more of a visual learner. Same. Me too. Zule, are you doing a competition? What do you mean? A competition. No, I'm not doing a competition. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. All right, let me... Let me get my handy dandy file. Let me get my. ¿Qué te pasó en tus uñas? Me quité mi uña. So, eso hace la diferencia. Ajá. Uh -huh. 
So look at this how you change it. You, I didn't have to use tweezers for a lot of things because you know with nails we cannot we cannot do a lot of things. So this is the new on point bit. Okay, I called it on point because bitch, your nails are gonna be on point. And I decided to get these because like I was saying, when I do stiletto nails, oh my God, girl. Those are the hardest, most time-consuming nails to do, I feel. Especially for me, because they need to be like kill a bitch sharp, you know? Like my tweezers. Like I could shank you and fucking kill you. Like that's how sharp I like my stilettos. So it requires a lot of arm muscle and a lot of filing and you get tired so not no more honey not no more we gotta make our lives easier no more carpal tunnel baby all right so you're just gonna stick it on there make sure to make it like perfectly in the middle i don't do nails but the same on my field if you don't practice it doesn't matter how many lessons you take Mhm. Mm i love those tweezers yes girl me too so Come on, you bitch. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Not there yet. I have to file the top part. Ha, psych. Let's keep it right here, though. So, normally, I like to file the top of the nail and then the sides. I'm going to be using this to file my sides, you know? You know, you know, honey. And the tip, because if you do your own motherfucking nails, bitch, you know it's a bitch to struggle straight up here. Nana ma, honey, nana ma. This is gonna be your BFF. Or another thing is whenever I do like those stupid press ons, oh my lord, with nails on, it's so hard. So this is gonna be my BFF, honey. All right, so let me just file the top part so I could get to my new bit. What else can I use for stickers if I don't have foil glue? Nail glue? What do you mean, stickers? You just apply them, no? Peel and stick. What is that called? It's my new on-point bit. We just put it up like two days ago. I don't have the box anymore. I threw it away. Oh, wait. It's over here. Never mind. No, girl. You could use it for whatever you want. Let me show you. So it comes in this little box. It's so cute. I thought they were going to be bigger, but they're so adorable. So it comes in this little box. And then you either get the files or the little bit part. So they are sold separately. Excuse me. So you just have to buy this once. Unless you're a clumsy bitch and you lose shit like me. So I would recommend buy two. And then you get 50 pieces of the little files. Like, I call them sandy bands because that's what they are. <sighs> and they're going to be our new BFFs. You know. If you know, you know. So I'm going to file the sides first. I mean the top part. Sorry, the nail art stickers that you have to put nail art gel on before and then sticking it and ripping it off. What? Nail art gel. Foils? You mean the foils? Gotta try it. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be our new BFFs. I think she means the transfer foils. Can't wait to try it. Girl, I've been using it with my... I used it on Mimi last time. And I'm like, oh my god, where you been? I'm just a little nervous how I'm gonna be able to hold the file with my right hand. Nail foil glue. So, I'm not sure what kind of foil glue you have. But if you have the gel one... 
you cure it in the lamp for one minute and then you rub your foil on top. Um, if you don't have the foil gel, you have to get some. The foils will not transfer if you don't have that. Girlfriend, would you rock some airbrush smile now? Cry later nails. I've never done that, but I'd be down to do some. I'd be over here filing like I can, like I use my right hand on a daily, huh? Pinch your right hand, mamona. Um, I've never used base gel. I mean, you can try it, but I don't think it does the same. Let us know. How was your day? Um, it's been I. I mean, I can't complain. I've been at home working, sending out you guys' orders, putting up some stuff on the website, trying to fix my inventory, you know, being a productive lady. What's the longest you wear your nail sets? Um, four weeks. I cannot go longer with my nails than four weeks because they drive me nuts. Like, I need a whole new set. Like, I get bored. Hi, K16. Like, if I have to wear them for a long time and I have no other choice, then I will. But thankfully, I have the time in the world. I'm just kidding. Um, I have nail stuff here at home that I can use to do my nails. Damn, my arm is fucking hurting already. What grit is that file you're using? This one is 80 by 100. Love the colors. Hey, Zoom, motherfucking lay. Hi, Devani. How are y'all doing? Happy February. Did you got Helen's products? Um, The gels? Yes, she gave us some in the class. Oh my lord, hold on, let me stretch this arm. I feel like it's gonna fall off already. I've been getting tired lately. It didn't work, girl. I I don't know, it's, it's a secret ingredient in there. Alexis, um, if you guys want me to follow you back, um, go comment on the picture that I posted of these nails. Okay, don't go to another picture or another video or whatever. Because I ain't going to see that comment. Go comment on the purple nails. These. These exact ones that I posted earlier. So that I could go back when I'm done with my nails or tomorrow and follow you guys. Harp Seal, thanks for the badge, girl. I appreciate the love. Can you show the nails on the other hand? Yes, of course. So one thing I am going to tell you is never, do not, FYI, put clusters or really, really big diamonds together like this because they rub against each other and they get scratched. This poor little bling bling is so scratched. And oh my God, they were getting on my motherfucking nerves. Thank you, WSARG78 for the badge, girl. This finger also had a, like a cluster, so all three of them will bump into each other. Oh my god, casi me mato a la verga. I'm so annoyed. 
That was another reason why I decided to take off my ring finger because it's already like hella lifted. Easy me lo dejaba and it kept bumping. Um, I was gonna end up with no motherfucking nail. We love you, Zuley. Ah, oh, thanks, girl. What happened to your ring finger? I took it off. I cut it off. Can you add me? I have to ask you something important. Girl, go comment on my on my page. I mean on my picture of these nails. And I will follow you back. I'm back, Zule. I just ordered the sugar glitters like you said and left your note. Yes, girl. All right. Can you reuse your ring finger? Oh, wait. Can you? <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so stupid. I'm over here reading two comments in one. Um, can you reuse the big diamonds on your right hand? You can if you want to, but I wouldn't. They're so scratched. I want new ones. But if you really want to, then you can. This Saturday, I have a client. Oh, my Lord. She likes her nails longer than mine. Like, my arm is already falling off. And I can only imagine what it's going to be like to do her nails again. Wow, girl. Te admiro y odio limarme las uñas. Gracias, yo también. Se me va a caer el puto brazo aquí, pero queríamos uña, ¿verdad? Like TMI, but I started my period after six long months. Remember I was telling you guys last time that I don't get a period often? I don't know if you guys are the same group or not, but girl, I'd be so tired. How do you keep your natural nails strong after taking out your nails? I soak my nails each and every time. And when I file my nails to apply my new set, I just do I just do um a light filing. I do not over file my natural nail. Let's see. I've been sick and the only thing that's made me feel better is doing my nails over today. I'm really enjoying your life right now. Oh, I hope you feel better, girlfriend. Can't wait to see you use the tool. I'm already sold. Okay, Cynthia. Almost there. Um, I am Kaya. You could just ask here. I'm already looking at the comments. What you need, ma'am? Thank you for being a real one. I love what you do. I want to be like you, girl. I'm well on my way, though. I just got into a salon. Okay, girl. Get it. Get it, girlfriend. Did she use the bit? No, I haven't used it yet. Hi, Nails by Mar. Can you reuse the big diamonds on your right hand? You can if you want to and if you can remove them in one piece. But I personally would not because I need them to be fresh, 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 not scratched. Mine already scratched the fuck up. They've been abused. Your voice sounds like my best friend's voice. Oh, really? When did you do your other hand? Um, I did it three weeks ago. Zule, do you still have your amazing glue? Hell yeah, Luigi. What do you mean? Always, always. Oh, my arm hurts. My arm hurts. Oh my lord, this nails like hella crooked. Honey, honey, why you have such crooked fingers? So let me tell you a little thing about my fingers. They're all crooked. Sadly, baby Jesus didn't love me. So this nail, this finger grows in. They started recently getting crooked actually because I don't remember my fingers being crooked like this. So my fingers are starting to turn in and so are my nails. 
So I try to like point them opposite. So that's why this piece is like right there. But I'm going to file it off to kind of make it look a little, a little bit more snatched. How you clean your brushes. I just clean my brushes with the monomer. Oh, thank you, K16. I totally missed her comment. That's because you be filing the shit out of them. Oh, that's why my fingers are going crooked? No, bitch. I filed these like a motherfucker twin. These are not that crooked. <laughs> yeah, it's only my left hand. You got E.T. fingers. E.T. phone home. I was looking at my nails from years ago. Look, let me show you guys. Let me show you guys a picture. Yes, you are my little assistant girl from Facebook. Hold on. The nails that I did. Oh, no, they were still crooked, girl. Look at my nails. I did those when I was in nail school. <laughs> look, look at that. They were so cute, but girl, what's going on with that nail shape, honey? <laughs> Hold on, let me pull up another one. Um, This one, like I was looking at them earlier and I was like, my fingers don't look that crooked. Like, yeah, they're chubby and shit, but like, mm -mm. nada que ver con mis dedos de hoy. Or maybe I'm just a really good model, you know, like I put them tight. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. All right, let's get to this this tool. So I've been using it for a while, and since I'm a lefty, I notice that it files a little smoother on forward. I guess if you're lefty, just put it on forward. Um, crazy claws. I haven't followed nobody yet because I'm still on here. So I'm going to put it at 3,000 RPMs because I don't know about how crazy it's going to get with my opposite hand. I haven't tried it with this hand yet. So I'm just going to use it to shape me my nails. Ooh, honey, yes, snatch me up. If only we could remove our long house like this, it'd be great. And then I'm also going to file the bottom part. The side wall nice and straight, you know. Oh, bitch. Not the pocket way. I'm going to be placing the order over the weekend for the glue and that new bit. Yes, honey, and the 3XL tips. We just restocked the 3XL tips, so get it. So now we're going to let the electric file do the job. What speed you going? I have it at 3,000 rpms because i don't want to chop off my finger here i recommend it when you barely get this tool to practice with it so that you get the hang of how it goes you know because right now i'm using my opposite hand i ain't trying to kill myself either you know like what if i lose control and me corto el dedo like you know <laughs> So, go slow, honey. Go slow. The point is, it's going to make our job easier. Ooh, girl. It looks like... Ya le rebajé la lonja poquito. Oh, my God. I still need to file a little bit at the top here. Out of correct. Wish I have that 29 years ago. Girl, right? That's what I was fucking saying. Like, I wish I would have had this sooner. So now let me do the tip. Okay, girlfriend. Oh my God. Oh my God. Look at her nail. How are you liking this so far, girl? That drill looks dangerous. <laughs> it sure isn't. I love it. I'm gonna be doing my nails every week now. Sorry, Pennsylvania. We're not a, we're not working right now. 
Actually, it it is a little dangerous when you have it too fast. Not gonna lie, and I cut Mimi last time when I used it on her <laughs> down here. So when you do get yours, make sure to keep um keep an eye on the finger down here and it's not too fast because when i was using it on mimi last time i forgot i forgot that she had a finger <laughs> and i cut her by accident i was like she going ham and then i'm like oh my god i'm sorry she's like it's okay but yeah so just keep that in mind my little boy just said you have to get that mom yes it's glitz world listen to your child um yes it is on the website already it's been on there for two days already or maybe we just got it yesterday i, I don't remember come on drill do you sell this bit yes it's new new it's here to make our life easier so we don't get no arthritis anymore. Hola, Morena. All you gotta do is hold it straight and it'll do the filing for you. Pa que necesitamos, um, pa que necesitamos una amiga si tenemos el electric file que nos limen las uñas. Um, ¿Cuánto sale? Um, Tienes que comprar el bit aparte. So, cuesta 10 dólares las limas o 10 dólares el bit. O si compro los dos, 17. I hope that made sense. What is the name of the bit? It's called On Point. Because our nails are going to be On Point. Look, it's this one. I'm going to leave it right there. I have long nails, but I can't work on ellas. What do you mean, girl? Hold on. I always struggle to file this stupid nail. It's like... No veo. That's why your nails are crooked. Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. Move box. Move. Honey, your finger crooked because you file too much. What's the name of the nude you're using? Um, it's called Cover Pink Nude. So I'm sorry I'm going slow, but you know, we're using this opposite hand and it's slower than slow. Um, what is the name of the machine where you put the disc? It's called Icona. Do you buy whole new bit when it gets old? No. Okay, look it. So the top part is like a sanding band. You take it off and you put a new one on. Look. They come with 50 pieces. It has a little sticker. And you have the option of just buying the bit part or the sanding band so you just have to buy one of these and then the sanding bands as you start to um need more or if you're like me a clumsy ass um if you're a clumsy ass like me you lose shit you're gonna need to i haven't chosen a name yet is it hard to remove um the sanding thing no you just peel it off like this. But I still need this. So I ain't going to take it off yet. Is this your first time using this bit on yourself? On my opposite hand? Yes, it's the first time. I used it on my other hand before. I love it. It's my new BFF. Because I always struggle to file my nails. Especially stiletto. Ooh girl that's why i kind of wanted to do stiletto but y'all didn't choose that option 
Y'all didn't choose the stiletto option. But the one thing that I am going to tell you is if you're a lefty, do not use it on reverse like normal. So normally for lefties, we have to use a file on reverse, but not for this one because it will file like crazy. I chose stiletto. I wanted stiletto too, but then I'm like, you know what? Let the publico decide. Is it sturdy enough? What do you mean? It has metal underneath it. It's a metal bit. Come on, bitch. How often do you do a full set on yourself? I do it every three to four weeks. Oh, fuck. I forgot to file the tip. Yeah, maybe next time I'll do um stiletto. Oh, fuck. I have to hold my finger. Bitch. I feel like I'm doing the fucking... A little twister over here. Let me speed it up a little. I don't know how to hold myself here. There you go. Oi, wait. Oi. Ay, ay, ay. Somebody hold my finger, please. Or maybe I'm going to try it like this. My nails are getting in the way. Okay, ma'am. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. I'm not reading the comments. I'm over here trying to hold my file because pinche mano, my right hand be dumb. Um, my file is not that fast, so I won't cut myself, but you could lose control quickly. <laughs> I cut my wrist with that bit. Oh, hell no, girl. I cut Noem Noemi. I cut Mimi the other day. Hold on, I filed this one a little crooked. We are concentrating with you. I know. I wish I had two left hands. That would be great. All right, now I'll pinky. Now I'll pinky. Fuck, I, I don't even know how to put my pinky now. It's like the farthest I go to the nails is like the awkward positions I have to fucking be like, like, ma'am. I think that thumb was the easiest for me to file. The other ones I had to fold. You cut yourself a few times. It's harder with a regular file. Mm-hmm. Alright, let me file the sides. Every time you start using it, I stop breathing so you won't move. <laughs> oh, 
That's funny. Um, orders take two to seven business days to arrive. I mean, four to seven business days since you place the order to arrive. All right, keyword business days. If you guys order on Friday night and you're texting me on Monday, where's my order? I'm about to ignore you. So don't do that, please. Because the post office ain't working on Sundays. Neither does Ule. It's a bit from space. I'm just kidding. It's to make our life easier. Yeah, you have to be careful with this because if you are going too fast, it could cut you. Kind of like a file, you know? When you are filing with a coarse file, you can cut yourself. All right, let me, um, I'm just going to file a little bit at the top to finish off some of the nails. I didn't do a very good job filing earlier. So the bit is to help you, um, with your filing. So you don't have to do too much filing, you know? You can always go in there and file a little bit more, but it's just so that you don't have to put in that muscle long term. Because when I, oh Lord, when I really started to do nails, I did not take care of myself. And um, my hands started to hurt after two years, like two years into doing nails. My hands hurt. And they still hurt until this day. So see, most of the shape is more snatched. I still see a little bit of filing that I need to do. But it's mostly from the top part. And then I'll go with my electric file. I'm just going to finish my little piling over here. I need this. What do you recommend for beginners? Um, Yes, beginners can use this. Just start off slowly until you get the hang of it. It's kind of like any other bit, you know? When you're new to an electric file, it's always a little scary and intimidating. But... um, The more you do it, the easier it gets how's your nail the one that hurt oh girl it's getting better it's getting better growing how did i meet my husband we used to work at jack in the box together that's where i met him Oh, yeah, you could use it on your feet, too. My mom, she actually uses regular files for her feet in the shower. Like when your feet are wet, you can file it off. Let's see. I need to file the tip a little bit because my nails are kind of um really wide, like my nail beds. So oh, this one be looking a little duckish over here. <sighs> Can you give online classes? I'm going to consider that as an option, but I don't know if I will. Maybe I'll try it. Um, The little... Bit, it's like a file, guys. You can use it on feet or on your hands. 
It's just a, like a sand, like a file, but in a circle. I just need to file a little bit on the tip because my nails are a little wide. Where'd you get the white flower stickers you use on Mimi? They're so cute. Um, We had them on the website. They're not on there anymore, but we still have some. If you want, DM me and I could put them up again. Um, oh, if you cut the feet, just go softly because even with a normal file, you have to make sure that the foot or the file is wet, I think. And then you just kind of go softly, not like hardcore, not like you're going to butcher them. What color is the lavender nail? Um, it's number 48. I don't think it's on the website right now. All right, they looking, they looking good. Who's ready for this nail art almost? Almost there, almost there. Me piqué a la verga. Hello, best friend. Este frío tiene la cola fría. <laughs> yep. All right. I think that should be enough. It's time to get to this cuticle area. Has anyone else done your nails for you and how how did they turn out? Um, The only person that's done my nails before is Mimi. That's it. I've never had anybody else um, do my nails. How many hours does it take you to do one hand? Mm, I normally take at least three hours doing the one hand. Oh, fuck. I have to put it back to reverse. Yeah, for the most part, I always take at least three hours to do with my nails. One hand. Design and all. Aquí en el chisme. I've never timed myself off Instagram. Um, I could tell because when I save the videos and I upload them, that's how long it takes. But I'm sure it'd be less time if I'm not over here reading the comments. Five degrees? Oh, hell no. I'm over here complaining with my 30 whatever degrees. Vendeme tu mesa. Where are you located, girl? Are you in California and near me? Hey, Zule. Hi, Anna. Me encantó tu cake. Oh, qué bien. So I'm just removing any deep scratches with this bit. And I'm going to seal in my cuticle. Palmdale. Oh, you're not that far. How tall are you? Because if you're tall, no te va a gustar. Is Mimi your bestie? She's not my bestie, but she's my friend. I'm 5'5". Five, five. Oh, you can kind of short. Pues si la quieres, te la vendo. Ya me quiero comprar otra porque I'm too tall. Is this a 5 and 1? Yes, it is. 
is the extra fine Every nail tech needs a tech to do your nails when you don't feel like doing them yourself. Mm-hmm, that's true. I'm 5'7". I'm not that tall. I'm kind of tall, but not that tall. Um, What does it mean when every time I take off my nails... My natural nails split in half. I think you need to put cuticle oil, girl. Whenever you have nails on, put cuticle oil down here and moisturize it. I have to be super slow on my table, too. I want to do my nails so bad today, but I had an allergic reaction uh, a reaction to the chemicals, and I can't figure out what's going on. Um, Did you do your own nails, or did somebody do your nails when you had the chemical reaction? How much is that flat bit on your site? Um, $10. $10 for the bit and $10 for the 50 sanding bands. Or if you buy them together, $17. Simona, I hit you up. ¿Cuánto compres tu mesa? Me vendes la tuya. I'm in need of one and I like yours. Yes, girl. I already found the table that I want. So yo te digo, mija. What speed am I at? 7,000 RPMs. It's pretty slow. I'm not doing it like fast. I just want to remove the scratches, the deep ones. Um, the deep scratches. And get into my cuticle without cutting my sail. Because, uh-uh. I feel like the key to not cutting nobody is slow speed, honey. Do not go too fast because you will lose control. It's like driving a car. I'm ready for my nails. I'm ready. I'm ready. Fucking the cluster doesn't let me file good. It'll be getting on my way over here. I'm ready for decor. I'm ready. I've blocked the entire month of March because I ain't missing your class. I'll go anywhere. <laughs> You're a funny girl. I'm hoping to have it the 1920. So you could open up the other dates. Where where are you from, manicurist? Nothing for Valentine's Day. Valio Madres de Love. Girl, it's, that's the what I'm going to do today. Valentine nails, but purple. Look, let me show you my design. So this is what my design is going to be looking like. Something like that. I missed the beginning. Did she use her primer and dehydrator? Yes, I did. Don't worry, you guys. At least you guys made it to the end. I'm just kidding. We're not at the end yet. We're like halfway. Todavía falta el diseñito. Um, my nail class that I'm gonna have, I'm gonna. It's gonna be actually perfect for beginners. I wanna have a beginner class. You know, like application, filing, and all of that good stuff. Um, and then one that's more like nail art, like, um, what is it called? 3D bling. Cause I know there's a lot of people who struggle with like 3D and stuff. So 
I'm back. I'm watching my 600 pound life and eating chocolate cake. Ay, girl, como. Como vas a comer pastel en frente de los que no pueden. My mom gets a reaction when she does any chemical with the UV light. The only thing she can do is the dip system. You should look into it. I've tried everything on her and that's the one thing that works. Oh, she's probably allergic to like Hema products. Because a lot of gels, that's what they contain. You should try looking for gels that don't have Hema. Or what brand gel are you using? Not all of them are the same. Yeah, whenever you're doing any service to a client, your mom, yourself, try to not touch the skin with the product because over time, we can... Um, we can become allergic to our products, you know, from coming in contact. Well, not just our product, like food. You could be allergic to any type of food anytime in your life. Our bodies are changing, if, like, over time, you know? Girl, I've been doing my nails for a long time, too, and I hope that never happens. But if it does, I'm going to have to wear press-ons. My fucking fingers sore already from holding this stupid drill. I think my drill's dying. Bitch, don't die on me. I have one finger to go, man. I have a reaction with most products gel polish. If it gets on my skin, I use Medusa. I don't have any issues with their products. Um, Yeah, a lot of... Well, Hema is mostly popular in the gel. Um, So you have to make sure to get some that have no Hema ingredient. Because that's probably what you're allergic to, Hema. Hives, girl. Or is it just me and my bad luck? ¿Qué dijiste, K16? I didn't see your previous comment. I'm getting so sleepy. A ver, a ver, a ver. A ver, la colita. That's the top brand of the soup. Okay, a little bit more. Can't find them out of Chan Soup. Oh! Yeah, they're sold out. In the stores. People buying hella maruchan. Um, my husband went to the store earlier to buy some, and he told me that they were all sold out. Cause I wanted some. No, they're like literally sold out. I don't know. Must be COVID again. He was able to get me a box, but like a box of six. Miren quien quiere línea. I went everywhere and couldn't find hot Cheeto munchies. Get a cafecito. 
Ya me lo terminé, mi cafecito, mira. The soups are probably stuck for real. Hold on. I feel like I need to file my middle finger a little bit more because it looks a little too squared. It looks a little too fat. ¿Quién quiere línea? Uh -huh. ¿Quién quiere? Hold on. Let me flip my hand. All right, let me file this a little bit at the tip. It's a little, it's a little flared here. You want to get high? You want to get high? <laughs> Towelie. Noodle shelves. I feel like I'm filing the tip. Nah. A little bit too. You can find hot Cheetos. What? Not the hot Cheetos. Hot Cheeto, hot Cheeto. <sighs> Baby Jesus, why'd you give me some white fingernails, man? I gotta do a little filing at the tip. There's plenty in Florida. Actually, now that we're talking about um low stock and shit, um, me and Patrick went to to the store yesterday and there was no tapatio. Hold on, let me file this nail a little bit. There was, we could not find a big bottle of tapatio. I was like, Lord. All right, let me. Oh no, I don't have to wash my hands today. I have alcohol. Where are my little wipes? Where are, oh, here they are. So I finally got me some 91% alcohol. No, girl, I have wide nail beds. Maybe depends which state you in. For real? Well, there was three little bottles, bitch. Best believe we took them all, all three. We're like the book. Mejor que se muera la lombriz, for real. What is that, tapatio? What, Luigi? You don't know what tapatio is? Honey. Hold on. I'm going to be doing a bling French on my thumb, so I'm just going to thin it down a little bit. Because with the bling, it's going to be looking a little fatter. It's the Mexican hot sauce with the sombrero, with the hat. So just FYI, if you're ever going to do a full bling nail or a French tip bling nail or whatever, try to do that one nail a little slimmer, just a tad bit. So um, when you put your bling on, it looks like the same length, I mean, the same width as the rest. All right, hold on. Let me clean the dust on here because I'm going to do some jail. This is just alcohol, guys, disinfecting my mat and taking off this dust. So this is the alcohol that I'm using. It's 91%. Cholula está bien buena, picosa sabrosa. Y yo ni mi marido somos románticos. Ay, ¿por qué no son románticos? All right, guys, are you ready? Um, where the fuck did my palette go? Who stole my palette? I literally just had it before I came in here. <sighs> Lord, my shit is always missing. Sorry, let me check the floor on this side. Make sure I didn't drop it. Hmm. 
What the fuck, yo? Hello, helloito. So earlier, let me share with you guys. Fuck. I dropped, I mean, I didn't drop. I could not find my, um, I couldn't find my iPad. All right, I couldn't find my iPad, and you know where I was at? Right next to me. Fuck it, I'm just gonna use this one. I got myself a new, a new thingy because last time I was doing gel, I never cleaned it, and they cured. <laughs> they cured with my light that I have in my face. I was like, oops. I guess I could put acetone on them, huh? I'm going to be using my new pastel color. Number 147. And my dotting tool. The fat one. And my brochita. This one. Hold on, let me get a little bit of acetone so I can clean my brush. Yup, it's probably like right in my face and I cannot see it. It happens to me all the time. Like I'm telling you, it happened to me with my iPad. It was literally right next to me. Um, The, what is it called? The, the case for my iPad. It's pink, so it camouflaged with my room. That's why I couldn't find it. I was like, what the fuck, bitch? Okay. So the pinky nail is going to be... Let me make sure I'm in my thing. It's going to be... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. I have to put matte top coat first. So I'm going to be using Zulate top coat. You just need to put acetone on that palette and let it sit for a while and then scrape it off. Okay, okay, girl. I'm going to do that after. So I'm going to be doing this nail matte. I'm looking at my little paper, the thing that I drew. This nail is going to be matte and then I'm going to draw some, um, some hearts. I'm going to attempt to draw some hearts. And sprinkle some sugar on it. Some sugar, sugar. You're going to finish your set early today. Ha. Huh. All right. I got myself a new lamp. It's from Koopa. I've been having this lamp for a good minute. I just haven't used it until two. I mean, I used it last time too, I think. So let me put my nail in there. I like it so far because I couldn't move and the bitch doesn't turn off, you know? Do you always plan out what you're doing before you go live? Um, sometimes I just have like a color or whatever, but when I really don't know what I want, I try to plan out my nails because I overwhelm myself sometimes. Like today I was like, okay... Let me have my followers choose what to do, like, you know, color, shape, and all of that. And then after that, I'll put my ideas together. So based on the answers, you guys chose square. Um, Hearts, I put, should I do hearts or should I do flowers? So I'm going to incorporate some hearts on my pinky. And then um, I'm going to put bling, charm, a heart in the middle finger. And then on my thumb, I'm going to throw in a heart too. And then what the fuck else did I ask? bling or no bling i wanted to see if you guys would do me dirty which you didn't thank you <laughs> i was like if these fucking bitches say no fucking bling i'll be sad but fuck it maybe it's time for a little simplicity but nope you guys were like bling i was like okay honey okay and then i'm gonna use my sugar where is it at Right here, I'm doing, I'm going to be using the sugar purple because there's seven of them. I don't know how many nails I'm going to do matte, so I'm just going to keep this on here so I can stick my head in here. 
The thing about this lamp is that you have to keep it plugged in. That's the only bad thing. I wish it was rechargeable. All right. So check it out. Prepare for the beauty. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. All right. So now that it's nice and matte, I'm going to get my dotting tool. Shit, it has a gel. Oh Lord. I've never done... I've never done a heart on my opposite hand. All right. If I could do a fucking heart with my opposite hand, y'all can do this too, okay? Never. What is late? I know, huh? I was like, fucking, maybe I'm going to be a new bitch. Maybe I'm going to be a new bitch this year. Ooh, I'm scared. Dang, your crystals are still on. You use that glue from the pot, right? I use both of them, but yes. Um, mostly was the cluster gel. Oh, Lord. Baby Jesus. No puedo ver. Dude, I can't fucking see my... Oh, my Lord. Solamente a mí se me ocurre hacerme esto en la otra mano. A la verga. Okay, I can talk, guys. Two sperms. <sighs> Breathe in. Breathe out. Bitch, I could barely draw a fucking heart with my other hand. Let's see. Look at that. Lord. Okay. Salió medio, medio. Now I'm just going to fill it in. Nobody breathe. <laughs> if I can't breathe, y'all can't breathe either. Pass out with me. Damn, this is not going to take forever. All right, let's see. We need to fatten this bitch up a little bit. Nobody breathe, guys. Nobody breathe. God, put your hand up a bit. Comments are blocking the hand, girl. I I can't move anywhere else. Oh my lord! Okay, I did pretty good. Okay, maybe if I move my phone, can you see it there? Now, now <laughs> I'm gonna have to try not to fuck that heart up. With all the rest of the hearts. Oh, Lord. This is a whole fucking nail challenge right here. Okay, I'm up for the challenge, bitch. Low-key, I like to challenge myself all the time. Because you don't know what you're capable of. Alright, so I'm going to try to make the hearts different sizes. This one I'm going to try to do bigger. So I'm going to make the, the circles bigger. <clears throat> I, I struggle a lot with acrylic Frenchies. I mean, girl, I struggle with everything that I have to draw. Pero más en la pinche otra mano. So this one I'm going to try to do backwards. I mean, I'm your pro. <laughs> I can't cure it. I'm gonna put glitter on it. Oh, I mean, I'm so sad. Nah, and then I'm gonna look at him like, the fuck is this, bitch? It's supposed to be a heart. Ay, 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 ay. Flash cure. I can't cure it. I'm gonna put glitter on it. So I have to do all my hearts first. Hold on, let me. Okay, heart, you looking a little funny. You looking a little funny. You look like a fucked up BBL. You be looking like a botched booty. Le voy a poner um, glitter, so no lo puedo sellar. 
porque el glitter va por encima del gel. <coughs> Tus permis te están saliendo bien. <risa> yeah, yeah, twerk, twerk. <risa> Bitch. Pinche bibi a mamón. A la verga. My fucking hand is twitching over here. Girl. Mm, fuck it. Nobody's ever said they have to be perfect. I'm just gonna call this nail the BBL. Like, how would you like your booty? Like, this one or that one? ¿Quieres el Tijuanazo? ¿Quieres el Tijuanazo o el del United States? Um... ¿Quién tiene BBL aquí? Raise your hand if you have a BBL, bitch. ¿Cómo dices cosas sin morirte de la risa? <ríe> es que no es chiste, es chiste. Chiste no es chiste. Y ahorita no me puedo reír porque luego voy a cagar mis, mis dibujitos y cómo me estoy esforzando, ¿eh? Me estoy esforzando de no cagarla. BBL, I'm dying. BBL, I wish. Quiero, ja, pero no tengo. I wish. I heard Tina Lua en Colombia got down on the BBLs. Mm -hmm. I will be raising my September 7th. Okay, girl. I want a BBL too, pero me da miedito. So, I was saving up for one. And then I decided to fix my teeth. I got veneers y valió verga. Can I breathe now? I'm turning purple. <laughs> yes, girl. I was sad before this. I'm glad I joined your life. Oh, I'm glad we made you smile, girlfriend. No mames. Si yo fuera un tattoo artist, no mames. Ya estuvieran todas pinches. Fucked it. You know what? I think I am going to throw the glitter on these before I fuck them up. I know myself. I know que voy a meter el dedo. Oh, oh, oh. Zuley. Usa la otra mano, puta. All right. Hold on. Let me sprinkle some glitter. <clears throat> okay, okay. Yo ni aunque quiera soy tabla. <laughs> This trend shall pass del BBL y LOL. Nosotros las tablas sin nalgas. We're gonna be the new, the new trend, okay? Don't fall into temptation, guys. Make sure to cover it very good with your glitter, honey. Okay? Échale, aunque hagan cochinero, eh? Que acabo no limpiamos nosotros. Ooh, honey. Hold on, put this in the lamp. Cure it good. Están chidas tus uñas y ley. Ay, gracias. Todavía no terminamos, pero ahí vamos. Está hermoso ese glitter, ¿verdad que sí? No lo he usado. Es la primera vez que lo uso en mí. Tampoco lo he usado en mis clientas, nomás un rosita, el azulito. I, y el purple, no, wait, el orange one. Y el pink, no, purple. You give me hope. Mm -hmm. All right, right now. Um, do you like to use Valentino? I feel like the quality isn't all there anymore. Um, I use their cover colors. I haven't bought their newest ones, actually. Ever since I started my own brand, I stopped buying acrylic from other places because I have so many damn colors already that a bitch got nowhere to put them. So I was like, ya no voy a comprar, ya no voy a comprar. 
like Sule, relax. But I do use everything that I have. Sule, move your camera so the comments don't cover up the nails. Hard to see. Tap, um, tap the right top corner and they should minimize. Why didn't you like why didn't you like your veneers? No, I love my veneers, girl. I love them. I'm just saying that I wanted a BBL. <laughs> I wanted a BBL, but I used my BBL money on my teeth. I like their cover powders. Never like the pigments. Valentino's quality has changed, and I'm sure it all due to supplier issues. I wouldn't know if the... Mm, quality change or not i still have the same jars from like forever <sighs> that's the bad thing about having too many colors like i'm such an addict and buying stuff that i still have old merchandise from very long ago oh my gel down here was not cured all right let me remove the excess oh my god honey look at that bitch ooh, ooh, ooh. all right let me continue i'm motivated now to draw better hearts like see that's not perfect it's okay because i'm gonna blind you bitch with my heart okay 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 let's continue to look at these hearts all right let's see my camera i'm gonna let me know if this is better okay do you guys think this angle right here is better hold on um okay the next one should be like right here Good view. All right. Um, all right, all right, all right. I'm like, I don't even know where the fuck to put my next heart. All I know is that I want my hearts to be all pressed against each other, like... Like, what is that? Is that a butt? Nah, just kidding. Is that a butt or is it a heart? Like, it was supposed to be a heart, but... Okay, there. It's only shut the fuck up. It's time to draw. See, me ven my ear hair. Don't say shit, bitches. No mames, wey, no pedo. Um, Liddy, Liddy, what's your real name, girlfriend? I have offered um mystery boxes in the past. I sh probably will add more because we have so much stuff that I bought in the past that I've never put on the website. That I need to get rid of because it's taking over my my place. Like I have so many decals, so many acrylics, so many glitters, so many everything. It's like me van a correr. Me van a correr a la verga. My mother in law was cleaning for me the other day. She's like, Zile, you have so much shit. Nah, she didn't say it like that, but she's like, you have so many things that you have never sold. And I'm like, I know, I know. I forget what I have sometimes. Patrick was just telling me like, you need to stop buying stuff. I'm like, okay, sir. It's not that easy. We saw Piojito. <laughs> No, not a piojito. It's un chinche. So I'm going to make a big heart here. She removed the glitter from the site. Um, 
This glitter? No, it's still on there, but they're sold individually now. I'm not sure if you're talking about this one. So these sugar glitters, they used to be sold in a um in a collection in a half ounce, but we put them up already individually in a one ounce. Do you feel more confident using your liner brushes since you took the class? Uh, yes, I feel more comfortable. Can you tell that I'm talking over here and drawing a heart? <laughs> I feel like um, Helen taught me how to, how much like pressure to put and stuff like that. Like before, I didn't know. I thought I just rub it on and swipe it on the nail. I even learned how to clean it and take care of my shit. But definitely, I got a little bit more confidence. Like, I could, I know I could do it. I just need to practice. That's why I tell you guys practice, practice, practice. <sighs> Come on, you little heart. Hold on. I just feel like you are more confident to do nail art in general. I see it. Oh, thanks, girl. I'm trying. I always tell myself now, like, girl, you could fucking do it. Okay, just try it. And before, I was like, nah, girl, you can't draw for shit. I'm being more adventurous now. More adventurous. People think hearts are easy, but hearts are and stars are some of the most difficult little things to do. Mm-hmm. Fuck yeah. Tell me about it. I can't even draw a heart on a damn paper. My hand is fucking twitching. Like, bitch, stop doing that. Like, we need a BBL heart up in here. Esas nalgas se ven bien buenas. <laughs> Ese culito... Ese culito que traes ahí me gusta. Anybody just joining gonna be like, the fuck are y'all talking about? Ese culito, what the fuck? Esas nachas. Yo quiero mi BBL como el corazón ese que trae la azulé en las uñas, please. Bien redondito y chueco. Uno está redondo y el otro está chueco. You know, saca tu dedo pequeño para más estabilidad. Mija, <ríe> no puedo. Estoy usando mi mano equivocada, pues. Y como que apenas se puede mover la güey. Si saco un dedo, me voy a caer. Me voy a caer de la pinche sí aquí porque no voy a tener nada de estabilidad. Ni te voy a mentir, eh. Ahorita ando batallando así nomás. Si saco el dedo, no mames. No mames, güey. Esa culiaquita. ¿Qué? Culiquita. <laughs> Dude, you're gonna make that stupid song to get stuck in my head. <laughs> ¿De dónde eres? Yo soy de California y tú. Mis papás son de México. Kuliki, whatever. Oh, my God. Y'all are too funny. You guys better not be missing none of my lives, all right? Because there's been times... <laughs> there's been times when I come live and y'all not here and I'm like... Hello, the same fun. Where my house at? So right there, I made a little half heart. <sighs> okay, now break time. Let's scoop some glitter. In here, I'm playing the oh my god, the Panama. Ooh, hola. Y'all are funny. We make a great team. Ooh, you from Canada? Campos Jocelyn. Scoop. Scoop. 
I do a lot of different crafts, but drawing isn't one for me. So drawing on nails is a bitch. Girl, tell me about it. Me drawing anything? Mm-mm-mm. I told my husband that I'm going to start practicing to draw, like, on paper. Like, easy shit. Like, Kirby. I love Kirby, the little ground, the little round gummy, gummy ball, gumball looking thing. So I'm going to try to do that. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to start doing that on, on paper. Let's see if I can do it on nails. Do what Mimi does. She starts the lives and walks away. <laughs> no, it's actually spelled Kuliki Taka. <laughs> How do you get the glitter off the nude? You'll see. Right now, when I cure it, the glitter is only going to stick to the part that has gel. Yo siempre miro... What? Ay, wait, hold on. Yo siempre miro... Me encantan tus lives, Ley. Ay, gracias, Liliana. Esa mano ni pa' poner glitter sirve. <laughs> For real. Mejor mochenmela la verga. Ni para limpiarme la cola sirve, la verdad. Me tengo que limpiar con otra. Por eso le doy gracias a Diosito que when I get hurt, the, this hand gets hurt, not the left one. O si no, como chingas, me voy a limpiar la cola. It's hard with the what? It's hard with the nail brushes. I can't even do a straight line. I'm sitting here doing my first set of poly gel nails while watching you. Okay, girl, how's your poly gel nails coming out? Never. I try to catch every live. You're the best lay. Always a good time. Good vibes. Thanks, girl. When you doing the other hand? Um, Let's see. Today's Wednesday. Possibly next week. Muy bonito trabajas, gracias. ¿No pesan las uñas? Un poquito. No te voy a mentir. Estas sí me pesan. Ya no las siento pesadas, pero cuando apentas me las puse, sí. Ok, miren. Así, this is how I take off the, the glitter from the nude. Just brush it off. Ok, voila. El glitter nomás se pega al... Al gel. Donde dibujé el corazón. Pero tienes que curarlo en la lámpara antes de hacer eso. Ok. Next, I'm going to do a heart. Backwards. Oh, damn, I don't want to wait till next week. <laughs> ok. I'm going to have to get hired for entertaining here. Like, ha, 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 he, he. My boss is not going to let me be having all these days off. All right, let's see. Probably on Monday. Because I have to go to work on Friday and Saturday to the salon. So I'm definitely not going to be here. And tomorrow, it's too soon to do my right hand. <clears throat> I'm done with one hand. An hour, 30 minutes later. Okay, girl, you fash. You fash, fash. You fash, fash. All right, let's see. Okay, heart. My hearts are getting better with this right hand, huh? How do you do it? Because I did the sugar coating on a client on white, on white glitter, and she said they would stain her glitter. Yeah, well, yeah. When you do raw glitter, it will get stained. She just needs to take care of them. It's like common sense, hello. Like, no offense, Clay, um, or anybody. But you have to think about it. It's like wearing white shoes. You can't expect to wear your shoes in a muddy place or outside and not get dirty. If you walking through fucking grass or whatever, you know, you need to make your choices wisely. You have white shoes on, you have white nails on. Obviously, you cannot even have Cheetos. You cannot put your makeup with your fucking fingers. 
You cannot do certain things with that, you know? Um, How to call it? What the fuck was I saying? Yeah, so when people get sugar nails or any type of nails, certain ones require more. Um, they're a little bit more high maintenance, especially if it's white anything. You know, because once I had a client who got white matte nails. Bitch, tell me why she stained them all with makeup, okay? Um, And I'm like, girl, why would you do that? Why? You know? So just tell them that my bitch ass boss is going to make me work on a snowstorm. Fourth, fourth, about to go to Fort Atlantica. It's already snowing. Girl, what? Tell your boss que no. <clears throat> Birria que sa tacos? No mames, honey. Boiling crab is gonna stain anything. Uh huh. Yes. Is there tips to keep the sugar on for longer? Um, I like to apply the gel to a rougher surface. So, whenever you do um any type of gel. Don't smoothen out the nail too much. I didn't buff my nails today because I wanted to leave a couple scratches. Like you can still see scratches on my nails a little bit. But when you put top coat, they go away. So you want to have enough scratches on the nail where um the top coat will still go on smoothly, but deep enough. Um, deep enough so that your gel adheres really good because if your nails are too smooth, your gel chips. It's more likely to chip, okay? And so with sugar, I feel like you need to apply the gel a little bit thicker and make sure that the glitter is pressed in. If it's going to be like a full nail or whatever. But as long as it's not on a smooth, smooth surface, you should be fine. Just tell your client not to be hella rough. <sighs> okay. And it also depends on your client, you know? Okay, 16. Congrats, girl. So if you know that you or your client are rough as fuck with their hands... Like lavana mano type of vibe. Do not let them get sugar nails because they will not last. Or at least don't get them in the index finger and the busy fingers. Sugar nails ain't for everybody. I'm a beginner and I did my daughter's nails, but it came off. I think I didn't do a good job on prepping the nails. Don't worry. Um, don't worry, girl. The more you do it, the better you'll get. I told my man, you better take me to Boiling Crab. Oh, me voy sola y me celebro yo. Más le vale que te lleve. O si no, déjalo que duerma en el couch. Damn, how many minutes has this stupid nail took me already? Okay, let's see. Yeah, she was, said she needed more glitter, but before I could touch them up, she broke a nail. Oh, hell no. She broke her nail. Oh my god. Come on, you fucking horror. Can you just stay still? You're in like one of the last ones. Come on, be cute. All right, I think that passes. That's enough hearts, I think. Maybe just like a little ear over here. Una orejita. Mm. 
There's like a wannabe little ear sticking out. <sighs> okay, girl, Zule, you are damn nail plug. I swear, every time I look at your lives, I feel like I'm a nail trap house. <laughs> I get high off your lives. Okay, girl. Mm -hmm. I'm a I'm a drug lord, as I've been called. Nail drugs. I only sell nail drugs. I sell nail crack. I sell crystal. I sell um, cocaine. Okay, that's the acrylic. I'm just kidding. Um, I don't want the popo to come to my house. Be like, excuse me, we heard you saying you're a drug dealer. Like, no, 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 no. That's just what they call me. Okay, make sure to cover. Oh, fuck. Se me cayó pinche glitter antes de que tocara la uña. Okay, okay. So, let me put that in the lamp. You always make my night. Oh, thank you, honey. I'm dead. Okay, let's see. Let me close this. Go to the Barbershop Cosmo website. There's a whole list of accredited schools. Ooh, I didn't know that. I'm going to tell my cousin because she was just asking me about schools. Sorry por echar cuentitos en su live. No te preocupes. Zule, big cartel. If you know, you know. <laughs> For real. <sighs> Fuck it, bitch. I was hard to get sleepy. No. Huevo nada. Leave this huevo. I mean huevo. Leave this cuerpo. Trabajador. Por favor. We need to put the bling on. Too much work for the sugar not to last. My sugar lasts. I'll show you guys updates. Like the excess comes off the nail. It's not going to look this puffy forever. But I never have an issue with it like falling off completely. I've done it a few times already. Are you going to save this live? Um, um, yes, I'm going to try to. I always try to. It's just your method of application. See? Teen Tea's Sugar Less also. Maybe you're skipping a little step. Um, let's see. Okay, so I'm going to do... Oh, I got a little... A little... I'm going to do... Um, let's see. Number 26. Wait, is this silver? Oh, no. That's fucking purple, bitch. All right. I'm going to do a little French with this glitter. What's up, Zule? This is Drell's wifey. We both fuck with your vibes. Hey, Drell's wifey. I'm going to draw a Frenchie on here so I could guide myself um, with my bling right now. So this is number 23. It's a holographic gel polish. Let's see. Hold on. Let me get my water because I dropped it earlier. Let me, let me drink some water. I cook, wash dishes, do laundry. No, girl, you do a lot. And it's not for you then. You do a little too much. We don't do all of that. Actually, I do do all of that, but um, not as much as normal people. I'm very grateful that my mother-in-law helps me come clean sometimes. And my mom. I need a cleaning lady. That's what I need. To help me do the deep, deep cleaning. You know, RIP for all the glitter on the mat. <laughs> it's actually nothing compared to what I normally, the mess I normally make. Look at 
at the salon, y'all should see the mess I make with glitter. All right, so I'm just prepping my brochita here for my glitter. A ver cómo me sale mi pinche French. Um... <sighs> Cleaning lady is goals. Mm -hmm. I don't have one yet, but I want one. Just for like once if once a month. Oh fuck, I already started wrong. Be careful on getting a cleaning lady. People steal more than anything these days. Fuck that. I would not leave that bitch alone. Sorry, future cleaning lady. I didn't mean to call you a bitch, but mm -mm. I'll be guarding you like a hawk. Nah, just kidding. I don't have nothing to steal in my kitchen or my living room. That's all I need them to clean up my restrooms. Not my bedroom. I could clean that myself. Cleaning up after I'm done feels like having to wash the dishes after cooking all day. <laughs> for real. Like, I like to clean for myself sometimes. Not gonna lie. Like, I enjoy it. But I don't got time to be getting on top of the cabinets and fucking dusting shit. That's the type of cleaning I need. No mames, look at I have like whole two levels of of glitter going on. So I'm just gonna do the the Frenchy outline part and then the rest is gonna be blinged out. Hey, when are you coming back to cut a hay? What do you mean, Monchis? I do not live over there. That's why I use plastic plates and forks. I deep clean when I'm hella stressed. I used to use um fake fake plates too and forks and my street used to make fun of me all the time. She'd be like, fucking way on there. Like, girl, ain't nobody got time. But now that I got me a dishwasher, I'm like, Patrick, wash the dishes. That's Patrick's job. Patrick's a dishwasher. Para no lavar platos todo el día. Mm -hmm. So, let's see. I think that's okay right there. Fuck it. It don't gotta be perfect. <sighs> I'm already getting tired. I work in um East LA. <sighs> well, until I get on Zule level, I'm practicing on my own hands every day. Yes, Kikil. It's best to practice on yourself. I used to practice on myself all the time. That's why I could do my nails, both hands struggling and all but i could do them so you could do your own nails you could do other people's nails all right let me close my brush it's time to bedazzle bitch my favorite part of the day i feel like i'm gonna fall asleep on this table already <sighs> i'm I want to try the pop-off method, but I'm scared it's still going to damage my nails when I take them off. I've never tried the pop-off pop off method. Is there a lot of crime in LA right now, or is the media line Astrid, I have no idea. I do not live in LA anymore. No shit. I've never tried the pop-off method, but I do want to try it, actually. If you guys... Oh, definitely a lot of crime. I was about to say, if you from LA, let us know. No, the crime is out of control and I'm in Southeast LA. I don't watch the TV, so what's going on? Fill me in. What's going on in LA? I 
I moved too far as fuck away from LA. Because that should be expensive. Alright, let me clean this up again. glitter get off media ain't lying i was asking since you said you work out there oh well yeah i work out there but i don't go anywhere i just go to work come back but i don't like know about what's going on last time actually there was a um some streets closed where i work at and i'm like what the fuck is going on over here but I never found out what was going on. Hold on, guys. It's time to bring out the bling. Pinche hueva, maldita. Salte de este cuerpo, trabajador, por favor. My marquees are right here. ¿Y cómo vas con el gym? La verdad, no te voy a mentir. Desde que empezó um, the holidays, I've been doing very bad at the gym. I haven't been going that often. So if you guys still see me fat, you know why. Because I've been lying to myself and not going to the gym. But I've been super, super tired lately. Um... Because where the fuck did I leave my trays? Um, I've been really tired because of the period, you know. Um, like I was telling you guys last time, I don't really get one often. So when I do, where the fuck did I leave the tray? Oh, they're over there. So when I do, like I get really, 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 really tired. Like, so tired. Like, if I haven't slept in, like, days. Um, so, that's how I feel right now. I was going to go in the morning to to the, to the, what is it called? To the gym. But then Patrick's teacher called me and I'm like, oh, fuck. I forgot that. We were supposed to have a call. So I'm going to be putting on some charms, some heart charms. Because, girl, oh my God, look, it's so beautiful. I just don't know if I should put these. I should probably put this one on my thumb. So earlier I was deciding whether to do like pearl, zebra vibe, junk nail, bling. This was the top part. That's why I have my uh, my other charms. I'll probably do this one, this hand that I had supposedly on my right hand next time. Like old school vibes, like chingadera media, you know, like normal. Okay, let's start this bedazzle. ¿Quieres tener cajas así de bling bling? Pues empieza a comprar tu bling bling. Hadi. Oh, oh, fucking shit. Um, yo he coleccionado mi bling bling por mucho tiempo. Es la, la que yo tengo. You should get those charms that spin. Oh, are those a thing anymore? Yo antes, yo... Um, Compraba mucho bling bling. Pues ya casi no, no los venden, ¿verdad? Porque todo esto es Swarovski. So ahora los que vienen en las cajitas no son um, Swarovski. All right, I'm going to start off with the charm here. And I'm going to apply it directly to the nail. Do you do classes to teach nails? Um, I'm I'm gonna offer a physical class, hopefully in um March next month. 
but online I don't. All right, I'm gonna do that one. Hmm. I started buying them from you, but you don't have any more. We have some on the website still, but we don't have too much variety. Whatever there is there. It's just under the highest quality bling category because we ain't allowed to use their name anymore. So we still have some, but they under a whole new category name. How much should we save up? For what, the class? What, what are you saving for? I'm sorry. You on my car, La La Land. Where are my charms going? I'm sorry if Ule is not 100% here. She's half asleep already. Hmm. Where the fuck is my tool? Mm, depending on what my rent is going to be like, I would say between 500 to 700. Hmm. But once they give me a price, I'll let you guys know the de the details. Hold on. I want to find a bigger bling. Like a size 16. Oh, right here, right here. Um, Do you put the bling under UV? No. This bling, this glue does not need to be cured. Um, It air dries. Do we have to be vaccinated to attend your class? Mm, you don't have to, but you're going to have to wear a mask for sure and get a COVID test because I ain't about to get COVID. Fuck that. Like, I'm scared of COVID. COVID. Normally, the classes are like a whole work day. Eight hours. And then that's never enough. Never enough time. It's like a whole nail fucking school day. Where you're like, ya me quiero ir. Ya no quiero estar aquí porque me duele el culo. Be like, no me importa, perras. Ya sé. No se puede ni ir todavía. Is this entire bling box in your store? Did you customize it? I customized this one. But we have a bling box. It's not Swarovski. But it shines very beautiful too. This one is called Bling, bling Heaven Box. Crystal AB. This one comes like this. Exactly. Except that crystal does not belong in there. For those of you guys who want a bling box, um, you can get one of those. We have them in a few different colors, but the Crystal AB one is the most popular. Ver, ya no hago uñas, pero si das una clase, voy solo por la foto. Pinche Zuleite, fuiste la primera clase que tomé y por nervios no te pedí la foto. Girl, ¿por qué no me pidiste foto? Ahora sí, con todas las viejas me voy a tomar foto. Be like, ¿quién quiere foto? I know, I went to a, a nail class in Vegas and this girl was like, oh, can you? She messaged me on IG, like if I could take a picture with her, but I didn't see my message until like later the next day. And I was like, girl, how come you didn't just tell me? I don't bite. Yes, they are glass 
glass bling blings. They are really nice quality. I've worn them on my nails before. I was like, I need to prepare myself. Prepare myself for when Swarovski no longer loves us. But thankfully, I was able to get my hands on a lot of bling before they stopped selling. So. Oh no, girl. Esta vez no me apendejo. No, Kika. No te vas a apendejar, eh? Que yo no muero a la verga, eh? I'm just going to put the same thing. Yeah, they look nice and shimmery. Mm -hmm. They gorgeous. Are you able to close your glue? No. It's super crusty. But if you clip off the crustiness, you can close it. I just don't. I don't even bother. I already know that I can't. Like when I use my glue, I like at the salon and here, I just let when I clean it around the rim. Oops, sorry guys. My phone is dying already. It's letting me know it's on its last 20%. Do you know why they stopped selling the glass ones? Swarovski? You mean Swarovski crystals? Oh, it's because my phone is dying. So it was letting me know. Like, Zulay, I'm dying. Hurry up. <clears throat> um, they were saying that they were going to stop selling them because we, the nail community and the DIY community, we are, we were um, pretty much making them look cheaper or something like that but i think it happened they also want to be like um luxury a luxury brand so yeah i don't know skating you know because their shit is expensive so they don't want just anybody wearing it fuck stupid little diamond why'd you get stuck fuck it that's pretty cute. Can I paint all the nails and later on the glue? What? Paint your nails and then glue them? What do you mean paint them? That's weird because I bought Swarovski at Michaels and it literally said for nails on it. Um, You bought them recently? No, like now since October they didn't want to sell to us no more. They let us buy Swarovski crystals until October of last year. And then they're not allowing us to to buy no more. <clears throat> this looks so cute. Bling 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 bling. Alright, now I'm gonna put it on my thumb. Yes, recently, but they're just selling what they have left. Oh, yeah. So, pretty much whoever has Swarovski crystals is allowed to sell them. But after that, we ain't going to have no more. I'm sure something better is going to come out. Or almost the same. Like precious. I bought some Preciosa crystals. I've been meaning to, to use them. But I forget. Tulip nail supply. Is 
It's because I do house calls and I have to close everything. Oh, girl. Um, I recommend to get the squeeze one. The little plastic one, the bottle. That one is easier to close. Because it doesn't get um, glue on the rim. So you should get that one for your house calls and then use the black one for the black bottle for your like your physical location. I haven't had a fucking Frenchie bling in a long time. I'm freaking cold. My feet are cold already. So guys, you guys have any shismes? Any shismesita? Are you looking for BAs? Um, not right now, but I'm going to be looking for some in the near future. We're talking about this earlier. <clears throat> earlier today with some young ladies up in here. I'm going to be on the lookout in a few months. I just have to get my my information put together, like what it is that I want. I haven't had the time to really think about it, but I need to get to that this year. Do you top coat your nails after you bling? Yes, I do. I like to put the bling directly onto the, the acrylic and then whatever else is exposed, like the acrylic, I put, um, I put the top coat. Come on, you fucking little diamond. Come on. How long does the wax pen usually last me? Um, I've actually had this same one for a long time. As long as you're not like beating up the crystals with it, it should last you a very long time. If you get any glue on the tip, um just file it and it'll be looking sharp again i bought some diamonds from china and they all keep falling off girl it's because not all the crystals are made the same um like the little backing can fall off really fast if they're like lower quality. So just make sure to seal around the edges. If you're using like cheaper ones, make sure to seal around the edges um, so that they could stay for longer. I had a heartbreak earlier. All my AB rhinestones got mixed up and fell. So I just put them in one container. Oh, hell no, girl. That happened to me a long time ago. Oh, my God. One of my clients, she dropped my bling. Oh, my God. I almost wanted to eat her alive. I was like, you are going to sort through them shit. Is this rhinestone box on your site? This one exactly is not. But I do have one that is similar, but it's not Swarovski. It's called Bling Heaven Box Number 2. It's under the rhinestone category. We also have it in um, emerald, like a blush color, and I believe it's silver. Just regular silver. I should have charged her double. I We picked them up and I made her sort them out. I was like, fuck that shit, honey. That is looking cute even just like that. Like, ooh, honey. 
I don't, can't even tell if it's straight or not. Okay, girl. Let's see. I'm gonna put my little charm. Okay, girlfriend. Face up, does your husband help you? Hell yeah, he does. He helps me with everything. Shit, without him, I don't know what the fuck I would be doing. He helps me way too much. My sister be like, yeah, you're so spoiled. And I'm like, so? He be telling me I'm spoiled too. I'm like, it's your fault. You spoil me. I tried to make my boyfriend do it with me, but he got frustrated. Oh, like sort it? Leave it like that with just the bling French line. No, girl. I need more bling in my life. I feel like my heart. Oh, fuck. I can't fucking see straight no more. It's like, lo veo chueco, but then lo veo straight. Lo veo chueco. What does he help you do exactly? Well, he helps me um, with everything. He helps me with my child. He helps me wash my clothes sometimes. <laughs> he cooks for me. Like when I go to the salon, he makes me my breakfast. He pumps my gas. He helps me with my orders. He does my accounting. He does a lot for me. He's my best friend. When I got a vent, he my he my therapist. Um, Zule, si nadie te ha dicho, a ver. Si nadie, okay, don't block me with my basic ass. <laughs> I'm not gonna block you, girl. It's okay. Zule, si nadie te ha dicho hoy lo perra que eres, es. It is perrissima nail tickles. Oh, thanks, girl. Should I do my parents' nails for free or discount? Your parents? Like your mom? Todo un amo de casa. No, pues tampoco no amo de casa, pero sí es. We do like 50 50, you know? We help each other out a lot. Recently, we came to an agreement that he's not gonna cook because he hates cooking. But he's still going to cook for me when I go to work. You know, because this girl needs to get ready. And she don't want to wake up that early. So while I put on my makeup, he cooks me my breakfast. And off you go, baby girl. Just making sure. Me estás dando esperanzas para el amor, amiga. Claro que sí. No más que algunas de ustedes, yo no las conozco personalmente, pero la verdad que algunas, no sé si eres tú o alguien aquí en mi público pequeño, pero paren de irse por los vatos guapos, ¿ok? Los feitos, no estoy diciendo que mi marido está feo, ¿verdad? Pero nomás estoy diciendo que muchas veces las mujeres... No más quieren a los vatos que tienen mucho dinero, que están guapos. But you know what? What I notice is that men that are handsome, cute, got money, they're fucking assholes. So you trying to get with one of that, don't expect them to be nice. Okay? So don't go for the looks. Go for how they make you feel and how they treat you. Because the looks are going to go away. Trust me, they're gonna go away. Y si tú eres un hombre y me estás escuchando y tú estás igual con las viejas, the looks are gonna go away. Those titties are gonna fall. Trust me, go for love, not for looks. Looks don't last forever, but a nice heart does. Okay. It goes both ways. God is late. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
It's true, tr because I just saw a video the other day. I don't know if it was on TikTok or where the fuck it was about that. That women always be like, men are the same. Like, fuck the, but it's not even that. It's that you choose the wrong men all the time, you know? Most of us growing up, or well, at least I'm guilty of this too. I used to like the bad boys. I used to love the bad boys. The cholitos were hella cute, hella sexy. But bitch, they ain't no good. They're not good. <laughs> they ain't good for you. They're just going to cause more problems, you know? I mean, when you're they're young. Most likely when they get older, they change and all of that. But it's going to take a few motherfucking years for men. Men, they um mature a lot slower than women. So... You have to be patient. And most of the time, you said those little titties are going to fall. And my husband looked at me. Funny. <laughs> yeah, he's going to have to be. How to call it? Holding them for you, girl. It's because we keep choosing the same pattern in different guys. But a lot of the time, we don't realize. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go for the guy. If you have a guy in your job or your neighbor or whatever, as long as he ain't fucking married, bitch, don't fuck with no married guy. I swear to God, if you fuck with a married guy, leave, leave right now because I can't fuck with you. No, 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 no. That's something that I, I cannot, I cannot tolerate women and men that fucking fuck with married people. I don't care how unhappy they are in their relationship. If they still there, it's because they love their partner. Okay? They ain't going nowhere. Hold on. Let me put some more hearts. <laughs> if, if he says I'm not like other guys, red flag. Mm-hmm. Yep. Like, bitch, you just like them. Or worst. I love my husband since I was 19 and he was 24. Aw. Goals, Heather. So I'm going to put the little hearts here. Mm hmm. See, we have hope, guys. I'm healing myself so I could get myself a good man. Mm hmm. And we do be having to go through shit until you find the perfect person. Like when I met my, my husband, I used to work at Jack in a Box. And I, I was like, uh-uh, fuck men. Shit. Because I already had my son. And I had already gone through like some little relationships. And I had just had bad luck. Bad luck with men. So when he was like trying to get at me and shit, I would like push him away. Like, nope, nope, Felicia, we friends. You in the friend zone. I don't date friends. I've done it already. Been there, done that. And it doesn't work out. I want to have you as a friend forever. Because once you befriend somebody, you date them and it doesn't work out. It's like you lose a friend forever. It's never the same. So I didn't want to fucking ruin that. But thankfully, we still here. We here. He didn't give up on me. And then I fell. I fell for him. When I was a little girl, I would sit and dream, hoping I would find the perfect man. Aww. Now that I can see... <laughs> what? Uh, true reality, teardrops fill my eyes because there's no perfect man. No, nope, Nobody, no perfect man or no perfect woman, okay? My man wasn't the type I would go to when I was younger. And I gave him a chance. Now we're going on eight years together. And he treats me, mister, like a queen. Biggest blessing. Uh-huh. Same. That's the one thing I always tell him. Because he's, like, more nerdy. And I used to be, like, a little cholita wannabe and shit. I tell him, I'm like, oh, my God. If I would have known you in high school, you would not. I would not talk to you. You know, te pelaria. But for some reason... Baby Jesus put him across my path when I had a different mentality. Because if I would have met him when I was younger, it would have never happened. 
it would have never been we would have never been a thing and he's like Zule's man he cooks cleans amazing <laughs> hard working good dig <laughs> uh huh there's hope guys we just gotta find the perfect man well actually you don't even have to find him he's probably over here trying to get at you and you're like it's the pinch of fail it's the pinch of fail yo no quiero ese Y'all be picky and everything. Like, there's a meme of Jesus that'd be like, Oh, Diosito, por favor, mandame un nombre. The, I forgot the exact details, but pretty much, um, it's somebody praying to God, right? For a man, a good man. Y Jesus le manda uno de, that's 5'7. And the girl be like, No, that one's too short. And he's like, Bitch. You told me to send you a good man. You never said, like, you can't be that picky either. You know? So, just keep that in mind. You can't be hella picky, bitch. He's like, you want a good man, a short man? You can't have it all. <sighs> Damn, you guys have been together since you were 14, girl? I think I have a better chance of finding the right guy at the damn cemetery. No mames, those memes of the guy I want versus the guy that want me. <laughs> You're funny. Yes, Ule, I agree with you. My husband is nothing of what I used to do when I was a mocosa. Mm -hmm. Chaparro, prieto y panzón. Hey, pero te trata como reina, ¿qué importa? Or, or, or the ones who be like, yo quiero this type of person and they're like totally opposite. You know, like, Yo quiero una güerita. Or um, whatever. And then it's like, dude, you ain't the best looking. You ain't the best looking person in the world either. So like, relax. It's like, baby Jesus, please help this person. Being too, too picky. Pero mío no más. My husband is still hot. Okay. Artist and guitar player. Okay, honey. My man be telling me that all the time. Like, you're so beautiful. I told him he's in charge of my health. And he just lets me keep eating. Like, you're beautiful. I'm like, oh, thank you. Damn, this is taking forever. Regálame su glue. No hace envíos internacionales. He is a well-known straight-edge musician. Ooh. Has he been doing music for a long time? Super cute. How long does it take you to do a set? Girl, it took me a long time. I've been here since... Since, um... What time did I get on? Like six something? Damn, today took me longer, dude. It's already 10. I need to hurry the fuck up and go to sleep. Yo me pongo más loca as I get older and my man more chill. Damn. I used to be more loca before, but I calmed the fuck down. It's like I got no more energy. Nah, I just kidding. My son thinks I'm fucking crazy. Are those Swarovskis on your nails? Yes, ma'am. Um, except two of the little hearts in here, they're not. You know I'm gonna put the good good on these nails. How do you how do y'all expect me to get some customers? And eh, just kidding. I'd be an addict to my bling 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 and it's super dazzle. Oh si no yan lo quiero. Dile Zule que me compra tu glue a mi little sister. Little sister, comprale el glue a la, a la crazy aquí. Comprale unos cuantos glues para que tenga ya inventario en México. I mean, en, en TJ. Um, comprale los little bottles, the squeezies. 